Hey guys, we just wanted to tell you about our new merch. What? We have new merch? Are you serious? Yeah, and it's so cuddly and adorable. Wait a minute. Do we have unicorns? <laughs> Daisy, of course we don't have unicorns. But we do have snugglers. What? They're adorable. Snugglers are your adorable, squeezy, cuddly friend. I want them, Molly. They're so cute. We also have backpacks and t-shirts. You guys can check it out by going to starsquad.shop. Now it's time to get to the video. Wow, I'm actually going to be to class early today. I can't even believe it. I'm turning over a new leaf and I'm becoming an amazing student. Oh, good morning, loser. Hey, don't call me a loser. It's a little too early in the morning to be called loser, okay? Can we wait till at least lunchtime, Sarah? I mean, seriously. Whatever. Losers say things like that all the time. Losery things. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I can't even win with you, Sarah. You're 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 driving me crazy already. Oh, uh, you've you've got something on your back there, Molly. Let me just get it off so you don't look like well a loser. Oh, oh, well, that was kind of nice of you. Thank you, Sarah. Better get to class. <laughs> you wouldn't want to be late, right? Uh, no, I definitely wouldn't want to be late. To be or not to be late for class, Molly. That's the question. Um, sorry, I got a little distracted in the hall. Oh, I hate to give you detention again, Molly. Take your seat. Psst, Molly, Molly, you have something on your back. Oh, I know. Sarah picked it off for me. She was actually being kind of nice for a change. Um, uh, Molly, um, no, I definitely think she put something on your back. What? What are you talking about? Good thing the whole class isn't here yet. Yeah, where is the whole class? My goodness, I'm going to have to give everyone detention. What's on my back, Rookie? What's on my back? It says, kick me? Sarah, did you put a kick me sign on my back? What? No, of course I didn't. Now leave me alone. Can't you see I'm finishing my delicious Starbucks shake? Um, I don't care what you're doing right now, because I am so angry. I, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. You're gonna what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this. Oh, she sprayed me with the fire extinguisher, Mrs. Smith. Oh my goodness, I've had enough of you two bickering and fighting all the time. After class, you both are going to go to the janitor's room and get brooms and start cleaning the entire school. But won't we miss class? Oh yeah, good point. After school, you both are going to stay afterwards and clean the entire school. Maybe if you guys work together and have some teamwork, you two can learn to get along. But she's the bully! Really? Because you just sprayed me with a fire extinguisher. Oh my goodness. I need a vacation. I really need a vacation. I can't believe this. Sarah, this is all your fault. Molly, um, I would sit down before Mrs. Smith gives you detention. Ugh, fine. Oh, Molly, I'm so sorry this is happening to you. I know Sarah's been bullying you since, like, kindergarten. Yeah, I can't believe I've got to spend the evening cleaning this school. You know there's toilets here, right? I'm going to have to clean the poo-poo toilets. Oh, that does sound awful, Molly. Do you still have that kick me sign on your back? I tried to take it off, but I think the me part is still stuck. Here, Molly, I'll help you get it off. There you go, Molly. <sighs> I'm so sorry again. I hope your time here with, with Sarah isn't too bad. Thanks. You're a really good friend, Rookie. I don't know how I'd make it without you. Well, call me when you get home. I will. Bye. Bye. Heidi, ho there. You must be the student that's going to help me clean everything. <laughs> I get a night off and I get paid. Now I have one rule. No cell phones. What? No cell phones? But, 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 but I need my cell phone. Hand it over, Missy. I don't want you texting on the job. I also wouldn't want you, well, taking selfies in the boys' bathroom. Believe it or not, we've had that happen. Um, okay. Here's my phone. Oh, I hate to give this up. What if I need to talk to Brookie? I'm not giving up my iPad. Actually, yes you are, unless you want in-school suspension. <laughs> 
okay, fine, here's my iPad, but I want it back, don't be stealing it. Do I look like somebody that would steal your iPad? Uh, yeah, you look like super poor and stuff. Oh, I can't imagine why everyone calls you the school bully. All right, well, get started. The, uh, the mop bu buckets are in the janitor's room. Have a good night. <laughs> I'm gonna go to Starbrooks. This is all your fault that we're in this mess, Sarah. Whatever. Ugh. I'm just gonna go chill in the janitor's room. He probably has a bed in there to take a nap. Whoa, he does. You have to actually help me clean, Sarah. I don't think so. This is more like it. Oh, she is so annoying. All right, let me see. There's the mop bucket. I'm just gonna go over to the sink and fill everything up. Oh, I know what I forgot. The soap. Is there any any in here? Oh, I'm, I'm gonna have to go to the supply closet. Sarah, the, 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 the door won't open. Whatever, you're just trying to prank me right now. No, the, the, the door, it's, it's, it's stuck. What? You better not be pranking me, or else. I'm not, try to open it yourself. Oh my gosh, well use your phone to call somebody. Uh, I can't, I gave it to the janitor. He didn't want me texting or taking sel selfies in the boys' bathroom. We're, we're stuck in here? Well, let's scream at the top of our lungs. Ah! Ah, that's super loud. Well, how else am I gonna get heard? Get me out of here! I can't be stuck in here with this loser! Oh my gosh. I'm stuck in here with this loser. Hey, what? You passed out from that? Seriously? That's a little bit dramatic, don't you think? Actually, this could be a perfect time for you to get to know me better, Sarah. And then you could realize I'm not actually a loser. No, no. I, I can't do it. I'm going to die. I can't be stuck in here with this loser. This is what I'm trying to tell you. I'm not actually a loser. Like, seriously, watch my epic dance moves. These are amazing. See? Not such a loser, right? I'm dead. I'm literally dead. Hey, those were good dance moves. What are you talking about? Okay, how about I sing you a song? No. No, see my eyes? I'm, I'm dead. I'M DEAD! Well, you're still talking, so you can't be that dead. And you st still can hear, so you can use your ears to listen to this amazing song. Oh, P-I-G-G-Y, a piggy is after me. Please, no more! P-I-G-G-Y, a piggy won't you set me free? See how long I can hold the note. Whoa, I'm amazing, right? I'm not even a loser or anything. Only the coolest people in the world can hold notes this long. I'm even changing notes. Hear me, I'm so cool. Please, God, take me away from this awful place. Really? She's so dramatic. Okay, maybe music and dance isn't your thing. Uh, you want me to tell you a joke? How do you make a tissue dance? Give up, give up. <laughs> put a little boogie in it, put a little boogie in it. Get it, a boogie, a booger, get it. <laughs> hey, Sarah, look, if we're ever going to get out of here alive, we have to work together. No, I am done with the world. Yeah, she is really dramatic. All right. Well, let's see if there's any, like, escape hatches or anything. Hmm, doesn't seem to be. Maybe we could go down the sink or something? <sighs> Sarah, I think this is going really well, don't you? I think after we get out of here, like, when the school gets back in session tomorrow morning, we could be, like, besties, don't you? <laughs> oh, <laughs> there you guys are. I forgot my keys. Have you guys been stuck in here? Oh my gosh, thank God I'm finally going to be out of here. Huh, being stuck in here for 24 hours was just more than I could bear. 24 hours? You were in here for 24 minutes. Huh, being stuck even that long with Molly is torture. Seriously? I thought we were best friends now. Sarah, wait for me. Aren't we BFFs? Sarah! Where'd she go? Oh, wait, there she is. Sarah! Why are you running so fast? You know I eat too many cupcakes and I can't run that fast. Oh, you stay away from me, loser! Oh, she's 
still thinks I'm a loser. Well, I'll just have to plan to lock us into the janitor's room tomorrow for another 24 minutes. <laughs> Maybe she'll change her mind then. Here comes Brookie now. Good morning, Molly. Good morning, Daisy. Good morning. Oh, Molly, I love your um autumn scarf. That's so cute. Yeah, she's been talking about it all morning. Something about getting ready for Halloween and stuff. Yeah, I'm so excited for Halloween and for fall and stuff. I don't know, I just I like when the leaves all change colors and stuff. Yeah, me too, but um, Molly, your scarf looks adorable, but um, you forgot something. Oh my gosh, you're right! I forgot to get a pumpkin spice latte from, from, from Starbucks! Oh my gosh, my day's gonna go terrible now! No, Molly, that's not what you forgot. It isn't? Oh my gosh, I forgot a, a pumpkin spice um donut from, from Starbucks. Oh man, I don't have a pumpkin spice latte or a donut. This is going to be a doubly bad day. <laughs> no, Molly, what I meant is you forgot your book bag. Wait, what? Yeah, did you forget your homework again? Oh man. I was so busy putting on this adorable scarf that I forgot my backpack. Oh, I'm definitely going to get detention now. Well, Molly, you could hurry up and do your homework right now. Yeah, it was just a handout. You could go make a copy and then do your homework really quick before the bell rings. Huh, I think it's going to be too late. It's definitely going to be too late. <laughs> Not me. I always think of the best excuses. Good morning, class. Happy fall. Mom, you took my seat rude. Uh, I'm sitting here because I want to be the best student ever. Sitting right in the front row, of course. Right, Mrs. Smith? Uh, sure, Molly. <laughs> Turning over a new leaf, huh? Yeah, <laughs> a fall leaf. Get it? Because it's fall. Oh, brother. All right, everyone. Why don't we take out our homework and uh, we can hand that in. I want to get that over with right away. We want to see who did their homework and who didn't. Well, Molly. Daisy, shh. Um, Mrs. Smith, um, you see, uh, I did my homework, but there was this stray dog that was eating out of the dumpster. Oh, here we go. This is going to be a good one. It always is, Daisy. I can't wait to hear her excuse today and whether or not the teacher actually buys it. You guys, be quiet. Okay, this is the truth. I did my homework, but there was a stray dog outside the diner eating from the dumpster. I felt so bad. I went over to see if he needed help. I put my backpack down, but my homework was hanging out of it. I was like, are you okay, stray dog? He ran away, and then, um, well, um... Somehow we got my homework out of my backpack and ate it. But he was starving, Mrs. Smith. I had to give him my homework. He was hungry. Oh, Molly. I can't stay for detention today. I have a date, so I guess you don't have detention. A date? Woo la la! Ugh, my stomach feels kinda. That, nah, never mind. Molly, I'm sitting right behind you. Excuse me! Oh, no, 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 I'm not done. Uh, teacher? Teacher, 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 teacher! I have to go to the bathroom! Oh, uh, okay, Molly. Are you just trying to get out of the pop quiz? No! No, 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 my stomach really hurts. I have to go potty, I have to go potty, I have to go potty. Uh, yeah, trust me, I'm sitting behind her, and it stinks back here. She has to go. All right, Molly, go ahead. Ha! Thank you! I knew I shouldn't have eaten that bean burrito for breakfast. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Ah, 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 oh my goodness. Ah, ah. <laughs> ah, that's better. Just gonna flush the toilet. Wait, what, what, why won't the toilet flush? Oh my god, this is so embarrassing. And I'm not done. All right, I have to go into this next bathroom because I still have to go potty and that one won't flush. <laughs> Yep, definitely shouldn't eat that bean burrito. Oh my gosh, okay, I just have to flush. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. The toilet, it, it, it started to overflow. Okay, I'll just walk out of the bathroom casually like nothing's happening. I'm as cool 
is a cucumber. I didn't overflow the toilet in the bathroom. No, 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 not me. <laughs> oh, boy. Someone get some air freshener. Stop! Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. The school is flooding. What? The school is flooding? What do you mean? The school is flooding, and I think it started in the bathroom. Um, uh, the school is flooding because of the bathroom? Uh, I don't know what they're talking about. Didn't you just go to the bathroom, Molly? No. Daisy, shh. Okay, everybody wait outside the school while I clean up this giant mess. Um, okay, if you say so. Oh, boy, that's a little embarrassing. Good thing nobody knows it was me. May I have your attention, please? This is your principal speaking. There will be an early dismissal today. Oh, it must be because it's raining and we're going to get a storm. Uh, yeah, it looks like uh, we're going to, like, drown in this. You're getting an early dismissal because somebody overflowed all the toilets in the girls' bathroom. And now it's flooding all of Brookhaven. Get on the school bus immediately and go home. Marty, did you eat a bean burrito for breakfast? Uh, uh. You're flooding all of Brookhaven. What are you guys talking about? Marley went poo-poo and it's flooding all in Brookhaven. Ew, gross. Um, guys, I think we better get the school bus and get out of here. Well, you guys should be thanking me. We got an early dismissal. <laughs> There's the bus. Come on, guys. Anything to get out of this doo-doo water. Gross. Yeah, you could say that again. Uh, Molly, why are you driving? I don't know. I think the school bus driver, like, quit or something. I quit, too, if I had to do all these early dismissals. Okay, Molly, well, drive us home. All right, here we go. I don't know. I don't trust Molly's driving. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm a great driver. Watch out for that sign! Oh, boy. You really are a terrible driver, Molly. Are you guys sure that your mom won't mind I come over to your house? She's probably doing lots of work. Yeah, she works from home on Mondays, so, you know, no big deal. Okay, well, maybe we should just ask her first. Don't worry, she loves you, Brookie. Everything's gonna be fine. Mom, we got out of school early! Wait, what? Uh, what are you doing home? Um, well, uh... Molly ate a bean burrito for breakfast and flooded the toilets and all of downtown is flooded. What? Oh, yeah, you guys are kidding me, right? <laughs> what really happened? No, for real. She really did flood the toilet. Molly, oh my goodness. Don't eat a bean burrito again. Is it okay if I hang out over here? Of course, Brookie. Mom, I thought you had a bunch of work to do. Uh, yeah, I'm just taking a little lunch break. I was about to watch some TV, and you eat a Hershey bar for lunch? And you're always nagging me about eating healthy. Well, uh, I'm a grown-up, and you're a kid. All right, guys, first thing we do on our um, early dismissal routine is get a delicious snack. What do you guys want? I got waffles, I got ice cream, I got pizza. Ooh, pizza sounds delicious. Mm. I am so too. Help yourself to anything you want, guys. Mm. That is some delicious pizza. What do you guys want to do? You want to, like, ride bikes or something? First, I want to, like, just chill out and watch some TV. Because, um, yeah, I don't get to watch TV during the day that much. And I really want to because there's always good shows on. No, there's not, Molly. Really? The Puppy and Kitten show was on. Who doesn't like that? I like that. I love early dismissals. Mm. You guys should have eaten an apple that's in my child feel. Does she even know how to be cool? Seriously. Puppies and kittens, they're so cute. Oh, I'm so glad I'm not at school right now taking a pop quiz. Instead, my stomach is full of pizza and my brain is full of puppies and kittens. Yeah, this is fun, but like, let's go outside and ride our bikes or something. Good idea. Come on, let's go. Have fun, girls. Be safe. We will, Mom. Oh, man. School bus got, like, stuck right there. <laughs> Molly, I love your bike. Thanks. I just got it. And um, the color green is, like, it glows in the dark at night so nobody, like, runs into you or anything. Oh, that's awesome. Hey, where's Daisy? She said she was going to stay inside and do some studying. Oh, of course she did. Whee! Uh-oh. Where's the brakes? Where's the brakes? <laughs> oh, ow. Oh. Are you okay? Oh, I'm underneath the bus. Oh. Well, Molly, you don't look too hurt. I mean, bes 
besides the fact that you ran into the bus and it looks like you're missing some of your teeth. What? Missing some of my teeth? Wah! It's okay, Molly. I'm sure the dentist can, like, sew them back in or something. You want to go to the park? Um, uh, yeah, okay. Ooh, Brookie, look. It's the Brookhaven Cemetery. I double dog dare you to go in. What? You didn't even say, d um, dare first. You just went to double dog. Well, yeah, because I definitely want you to go in there. I'm not afraid. I could go in there. There's, there's nothing in there. I gotta see this one. <laughs> Right before Halloween, she goes into a graveyard. She's super brave. See, Molly, there's nothing in here to be afraid of. Not a single... Oh, my God! Is that a ghost? Molly, run! Ah! Oh, my God, oh, my God, oh, my God. There's a ghost in the cemetery! Of course there is! There's a lot of dead people in there! Well, Molly, <laughs> this has been a pretty crazy early dismissal routine. Yeah, there was nothing routine about it. And, um, Molly, you might want to go have your teeth sewn back in. Yeah, I'll worry about that tomorrow. Right now, I just want to soak up this autumn sun while I'm not in school. So, Molly, do you want to tell me what happened to your teeth? Uh, well, uh, well, it all started at school because I had a bean burrito. Oh, boy, I can tell already this is going to be one crazy story. <laughs> subscribe to our channel guys we're trying to get to 2 million subscribers guys today we are so excited right Daisy totally Molly because Pat Stabber one of our favorite game developers just did a huge update on grandma's house this is one of our favorite games guys and we can't wait to play this new update so let's do this whoa Molly she, her, her eye lights up uh, Daisy, she looks terrifying. Oh my gosh, what's wrong with her head? She's definitely crazy, Molly. She's got a crazy glowing eye. There's flies, like look at her. There's flies um, just buzzing around her. Well, let's click play because I'm excited to meet this new granny. Uh, Molly, I think she definitely wants to kill us. Well, don't worry because we're in here with baby Yoda, so we're going to be fine. <laughs> Molly, what do you have leaves and pumpkins over your head for? Because it's almost Thanksgiving, which means pumpkin pies, jumping in the leaves. I love pumpkin pie. Oh, so don't I, dear, when it's full of poison. <laughs> uh, Granny, I think you went a little insane. A little, Molly? Holy guacamole. Come on, Daisy, I'm so excited to see this update. Holy guacamole! Um, yeah, I don't remember this in the original game. Ah! Killer cat, killer cat, k -k 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 killer cat. Oh boy, Molly, <laughs> you got seriously killed by an adorable little kitty. Adorable? They're not adorable. Oh, they killed me again! Wow. Um, Pack Stabber Abbies, you made this like really difficult. I can't get past your killer cats. I'm already past them. Well, good for you. Maybe if I bribe them with a pumpkin pie. Hey, um... Uh, ah, no, please! Don't keep biting me! You're so epically rude, cat. I can make it this time. I can make it... Ah, no, that last cat! That last cat is so rude. Molly, just try to be nice to the cats. Guys, I have to tell you, I'm more of a dog person. I know that comes as a surprise to some of you, but... Oh, ha, ha, ha! I did it! Oh, yeah. <laughs> what? He makes a crazy sound when you when you click on the um save. I know, Molly, right? And his mouth moves. That's so original. All right, here are some yarn lollipops. I know. Aren't those amazing? No, Granny, they're not amazing. They're a trick because who wants a yarn lollipop? <laughs> oh, there's his mouth. His mouth is moving again. All right, Daisy, let's go up into this um, tunnel and air duct, Molly, air vent or whatever, not tunnel. Well, it feels pretty tunnel-y to me. Molly, your <laughs> autumn outfit's kind of ridiculous. It's an autumn aura. That's what it said. My aura is pumpkin pie. <laughs> Molly, you have food on the brain. Uh, maybe, yeah, just a little bit. Okay, if, if I jump over this, 
Where do I go? Oh, you can't! No, Molly, you really can. <laughs> Come on, Molly. Do Ew, Molly, these are teeth. Yeah, and they look like fossils. That's how old Granny is. Watch out for the hot steam, Molly. We all know what will happen if you touch that. Yeah, you'll be dead, dead, dead! Okay, is there someone in the coffee cup? She's in there taking a nap! Mel Mel, what are you doing? She's sleeping, Molly. Don't disturb her. <laughs> <laughs> she kind of looks cute. What's in this cup? Nothing. It's empty. Uh, I definitely would like some cookies and milk for my real grandma after playing this because it just seems like a little bit cray cray. Daisy, do you know where you're going? I hope so, Molly, but not really. <laughs> Daisy got lost. Whatever, Molly. You think you're better with these air duct puzzle tunnel things? Uh, not really. That's why I always follow you. <laughs> <laughs> um, guys, where is Granny? This is the room we were in to start. And, guys, she's gone. What's this? Granny's underwear? Ew, gross. <laughs> you got killed by Granny's underpants. OMG. Actually, I think she's knitting herself some underwear. <laughs> Probably. Grannies do weird things like that. It's all kind of itchy to me. Yeah, Molly, super itchy. Could you stop dying already? I didn't die. I'm just like taking a nap. Yeah, you take a nap with X's over your eyes like a noob. Whatever, Daisy, whatever. I'm doing my best right now. OMG. Yes, I made it. Hooray. All right, guys. I just have to say, <laughs> so far, this game is completely different than how it used to be. Right, Daisy? Yeah, everything looks different. It's like a brand new game. I really like it. I love the Escape Granny's House. All of these were always so much fun. <laughs> <laughs> I think there's more than one, uh, but this is my favorite, the one by Packstabber. He makes amazing games. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Molly, be careful. The boards break. What? He made it to the boards break? That's just evil. <laughs> Don't worry, Molly. We can do this. What's in this drawer? No time to look. And besides, there might be more granny underwear. <laughs> Ew, gross. Oh, I got fried. Like, literally. I literally got fried. Um, so you have to be very careful in this spot not to go over the edge. Uh, oh my gosh. There's a tooth on the actual um, breakfast she's making. It looks like sausage and some eggs and some tea. <laughs> Maybe it was a brain she was cooking. Wow, that was dark, Daisy. A brain? Holy guacamole. This time the food is booby-trapped, so don't touch it. But Daisy, chocolate chips! Molly, I warned you they were booby trapped. Duh. Sorry. <laughs> I wasn't listening. I was too busy thinking about cookies. Wait, did I say chips before? I don't know. I'm so frazzled right now. No, I think you said chocolate chips, Molly. Uh, guys, did I say chocolate chips? Let me know in the comment section below. Because when I see a cookie, my brain goes kind of crazy. So I may have just said chips. I don't know. I don't know. I, I try to eat them, though. They're definitely booby trapped. And deadly. <laughs> oh, that one's wrong, Daisy. It's this one, Molly. Oh, <laughs> Trixie Bridges didn't trick Daisy. I beat you, Daisy. Yeah, only because I knew where we were going because I figured it out. Uh, Daisy? Crazy Granny, Crazy Granny, Crazy Granny, yeah. I'm in Granny's house and I'm kind of sad I came. I'm in Granny's house and she's totally insane. Crazy Granny, Crazy Granny. Oh, Molly, you died. Bummer. It's all right, it's all right. I'm going to come back to life in three, two, one. Yes. All right, where am I? I don't know where how to get to where I'm going. Oh, yeah, okay. Going to jump over these twirling yarn balls up onto this ledge. What? Oh, get a little closer, my dear. I'd love to eat you for lunch. What? Eat me for lunch? No, I said meet you for lunch. It sort of sounded like eat you for lunch. Are you sure you didn't say eat? What? No, that just sounds terrible. Of course not. Molly, I don't trust you. Well, there's nowhere to go but to die. <laughs> Molly, 
and E. Hey, look, Mel Mel's up from her from her slumber, from her nap, guys. She she was uh she was definitely taking a nap. Well, I I was a little afraid, and things were getting a little stressful, so I decided that I needed a nap. Well, Mel Mel, just so you know, I'm pretty sure Granny's trying to eat us for lunch. I didn't say. Th uh, I told you. Marley, you're making Granny frazzled. Frazzled. Well, Jiminy Cricket, how does she think I feel? All right, guys, I'm doing this overhead shot because I'm sort of a noob right now. I'm just, I'm trying to survive. Ah, I knew it. Oh, look at Granny's fat belly. Uh, do not hate me, please, please, please. You said me, not eat. Well, a girl <laughs> change her mind. Marley, she said she was a girl. Now we know she's evil. Because she's got to be a thousand years old. So that was a lie. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'd say so. Especially since she's got a severed head in her stomach. Don't forget the hand, too. Ew, gross. All right, guys. Um, <laughs> we have to try to not die in here because then we'll become Granny's lunch. And I really don't want to be her lunch. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> Yeah, me either, Molly. It looks like some unfortunate souls already have, though. I almost just died, Daisy, because you were yap, 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 yap. Molly, don't be rude. I'm just talking to you. Gosh, don't you want me to talk to you? Um, uh, uh not really. Molly! We're in this together. We're in it to win it. Uh, I'm in it so that I can get out of here and eat a delicious cookie. Ooh, cookies. Cakes! <laughs> Marty, seriously, jump on these squishy brains and let's get out of here. Ugh, gross! Oh, gosh, no! I died in Granny's stomach! Now I'm gonna be here forever. Forever and ever! Just kidding. <laughs> it's just Roblox, guys. Of course I can go back to life. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Alright, now where are we going? Uh, Molly, we're going out. What do you mean, out? Ew! She means out! Ew! <laughs> Molly, look, they arrested Granny. Yeah, but there's still all these booby traps she left. We're not in the clear yet. Now we are, though. Oh, look at all these. <laughs> look, you can have a face like Granny's. This is like mine right here. Zoinks! Yeah, somebody fought it. That's what my face is. Um, well, uh, it wasn't me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy, Molly. Um, you can go get a hat, <laughs> or you can, um, do other fun stuff here. I could buy a hat, but right now I just want to be like, Hey, Granny, look what happened to you. Hold it right there, Granny. You're coming with us. What? I didn't do anything. Well, first of all, you're wearing that knitted, um, like, track suit or whatever. That's a crime in itself. <laughs> Hey guys, thanks so much for watching today. If you haven't yet, check out Pack Stabber's new updated version of his Escape Granny's House because it's super fun. Yeah, super fun, guys. And uh, don't forget to subscribe, guys. Come on, help us get to 2 million subscribers. Bump ba da da. All right, guys, bye. Starbucks before school in the morning. How else could I make it through the entire school day? Speaking of school days, this school day I'm actually excited about. I know, that's crazy, right? I'm never excited about going to school, but today I am because this weekend's the school dance. And I just know that Luke is gonna ask me. Today's gonna be the most amazing day because he's gonna say, Molly, will you go to the dance with me? And I'm gonna say, of course, Luke, because we're in love and we're going to get married. Okay, I probably won't say that. I'll probably just say, yeah, I'm going to go dance with you. And I'll leave the marriage stuff for, you know, after high school. Good morning, Marley. Whoa, you're not even late today. I know, right? It's going to be a beautiful day at school. Uh, okay. What have you done with my sister? Are you an alien? A monster? <laughs> no, I'm just excited about the school dance. I am too, Marley. I wonder if someone will ask me. I don't know, but Luke's definitely going to ask me. Oh, hi, Luke. Oh, having your Starbucks, I see, Molly. Yeah, are you eating a burger for breakfast? Yeah, 
It was leftover from last night. I was too lazy to make anything else. <laughs> hey, a burger works for me. Whatever you want. So, uh, Luke, you, you got something to ask somebody? I sure do. And here she comes now. Hey, Sarah. Um, I wanted to, to, uh... What are you saying, Luke? I mean, are you going to spit it out or am I going to stand here all day? What are you asking her, Luke? Um, uh, will you, um, go to the dance with me? Wait, what? What did you just say? He said, will you go to the dance with me? Uh, were you talking to Sarah or somebody else? Excuse me, is this your special moment? Because you keep butting in like it is. I think I just got asked to the dance, so why are you here? Oh, um, uh... So, Sarah, w will you go to the dance with me? Of course I will. What? No! No, this can't be happening! No! Oh, <laughs> Luke was supposed to ask me to the dance! <laughs> My entire life is ruined. Luke is my is my best friend, but also uh, <laughs> I have the biggest crush on him, and now he's gonna take Sarah to the dance. <laughs> Molly, Molly, are you? Oh, there you are, Molly. Oh, Molly, I'm so sorry. You're so sad. My life is over. Oh, Molly, there's plenty of fish in the sea. Well, I can't take a fish to the to the school dance. What are you even talking about? No, that's just what they say. Like, there's lots of boys. I don't I don't want any other boy to take me to the dance. I just wanted Luke to. Well, Molly, I'm sorry, but he's taking Sarah. Thanks, Captain Obvious. I already know that. I know what I could do. I could cast a spell. Make Sarah disappear. I mean, temporarily, just until the school dance is over. Wait, what? You can't do that, Molly. That's a horrible idea. You're going to make her disappear? She'll miss class. And then she might get detention. You mean she doesn't get to go with Luke to the dance and she gets detention? Perfect. Molly, come back here. Don't you dare cast a spell. Molly, this is a bad idea. What are you doing, Molly? You missed all of class. Um, <laughs> I was just prepping to do this. To do what? Wait, wait, what's that book and that wand for? Oh, you just wait and see, Sarah. You just wait and see. Alakazam! Alakazir! I'm gonna make Sarah disappear! What? What's happening? What's happening? Sarah? Sarah? Oh my gosh! My spell! It, 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 it worked! <laughs> ah, I even laugh like a witch, don't I? This is perfect. Now the glass me to the dance. <laughs> hey Molly, have you uh seen Sarah? Oh, <laughs> yeah, but she disappeared. Wait, what? Yeah, like permanently, she's gone. Well, at least till after the dance. Wait, wh why did she disappear? What are you talking about? Um, uh, uh, she got snowed and she's sick. She can't come. Oh man, I was gonna take her to the dance. I was really excited. You didn't have to be that excited. I mean, she wasn't that special. Um, okay, Molly. Are you okay today? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. Okay, well, I'm just asking because you seem like, well, a little grumpy. Do you have to fart? No, I don't have to fart. Okay, yeah, maybe I did a little. Yeah, see, don't you feel better, Molly? No! Oh my gosh, I have to get to my next class before I'm late. Hey, Brittany, you want to go to the dance? Oh, Luke, I thought you were taking Sarah, but oh my gosh, I can't believe you chose me. Of course I'll go to the dance with you. Wait, what? Now you're going to take her? Yeah, she's super cool. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh, she doesn't even know what one plus one is. But she's super nice. Ugh. Molly, are you okay? Okay, she's running towards the bathroom. She must have to go poo-poo or something. Daisy! Molly, what are you doing in here? I'm just washing my hands so I can get ready for lunch. Daisy! I have to eliminate all girls on the planet! What are you talking about? Make them disappear. Goodbye, Kaplooey! He asked another girl to the dance after I made Sarah disappear! 
Molly, I think it's a bad idea that you're making all ghosts disappear. What about me? Well, it's only for a little bit. I have to, Daisy. I have to. Molly, are you okay? I will be. I will be. Alakazam! Alakazir! Let's make all the girls disappear! Ha 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 ha! Whoa, the sky went all funny for a minute there. Uh, does that mean it worked? I'm not really sure. I guess if I go back to the school and I see any girls, I'll know that my spell failed. And I don't see any girls. Jiminy Cricket, my spell actually worked. Hey, Molly, what's up? Oh, hey, Sam. Uh, not much. Just having a better day all of a sudden. That's good, Molly. Oh, look, there's another boy. Hey, Molly. Oh, hey, Aiden. Wow, there really are no girls here. Perfect. Whoa, there's Luke. Molly, have you heard the news? It seems like all the girls in the entire school have disappeared. They must have all got snowed or something. Oh, wow. So, um, you can't take Sarah to the dance. You can't take Brittany to the dance. No, I can't take any girls to the dance. Wait, what? No, no, you can't. Either there's, there's a girl left. Oh, uh, well, I guess I didn't really even want to go to the dance. It's sort of a girl thing. I mean, I like to dance, but I can dance at home. And sometimes I even make videos for TikTok. Want to see one? Um, uh, not really. So, who are you going to take to the dance? Nobody. If I go, I guess I'm just gonna go alone. I mean, there's no girls to ask. What are you talking about there's no girls to ask? There's lots of girls to ask! Well, I mean, not lots, but th there's one! Really? Where? I don't... I don't see a girl anywhere. Me! I'm a girl! Oh, yeah! I forgot you were a girl! <laughs> You're just like my best buddy, my best friend. I just think of you as, like, I don't know, not, not really a, a girl. Well, I am a girl! That's it. This spell didn't work. I gotta go talk to my sister, Daisy. I'm feeling so sad. Daisy, are you still in the bathroom? Wait, maybe she was having lunch. She said she was gonna have lunch. Daisy? Wait a minute. There, there's no Daisy because I disappeared all the girls in Brookhaven. So, so, Daisy's a girl and now I don't have my sister. I have to reverse this spell. I have to reverse it. Okay, I can do this. I mean, I'm not really good at reversal spells. They usually go wrong, but, but, but I think I can do it. I hope I can do it. I need my sister back. I need to talk to her. I'm having a really bad day. Alakazam! Alakazun! My last spell. Be undone! Did it work? Did it work? Molly, there you are. Hi. <laughs> I'm so in love with you. Will you go to the school dance with me? Wait, what? I've been thinking about you all day and my heart just breaks when I'm not near you. Oh, Molly, you're my girlfriend. I am? No, she's my girlfriend. No, she's not. She's my girlfriend. Okay, I'm neither of your girlfriends. She's my girlfriend. No, she's mine. Uh-oh. This reversal spell didn't seem to work. Uh-oh. Gotta go. Gotta go to the bathroom. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, uh, finally. Oh, Molly. This is the girl's bathroom. Because I'm in love with you. Oh, you're stinky. I know, that's why you're not supposed to be in here. I don't care if my love for you is true. Ah! Get out of the girl's bathroom. Oh my gosh, where can I hide? I'm so embarrassed right now. He saw me fart. Oh, that is so embarrassing. I know how to make myself feel better. I just need a slice of pizza. That makes the everything in the world so much better. Mm. That's good pizza. Hey, you like pizza? So don't I. Huh? What? Oh, I can't believe it. You're going to be my girlfriend. Wait, no I'm not. What are you talking about? Yeah. <laughs> we are. We're going to go to the dance together and we, we lo both love pizza. Why wouldn't we go to the dance together and be boyfriend and girlfriend? Oh my gosh! The school has gone completely crazy! Daisy! Did my spell bring all the girls back? Miley, what's going on? Daisy! Oh my gosh, I'm so glad to see you. What do you mean you're so happy to see me? It's during the school day, of course I'm here. Oh, Daisy, I made a huge mistake! What are you talking about, Miley? What's going on? Well, it all started when... Oh, 
Alakazam! Alakazam! My last spell. Be undone! Did it work? Did it work? Boo, 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 boo. Let me get this straight for a second. You, you, you did a reversal spell? So what was the spell to begin with? Um, well, you don't remember this, I guess, but I... I made it so that all the girls would disappear so Luke would ask me to the dance. And it didn't work and I needed to talk to you and so, um, here we are. And, uh, when I reverse the spell, now all the boys are in love with, well, me. Wait. Whoa, whoa, whoa. So you did a spell to make me and all the other girls disappear so you wouldn't have any competition for Luke? Correct. And then when it didn't work, you wanted me back? Correct. So you did it with Vosel spell? Correct. And it backfired and now all the boys at school are in love with you? Also correct. Molly! You should stop doing spells! Obviously you're terrible at that! Um, uh, uh, exactly my point. Now what are we gonna do? I can't wait to take a selfie with my new girlfriend! New girlfriend? What's he talking about? Oh no, he means me. Oh, Molly, when you're making that angry face, you're so beautiful! What? No, I'm not! I look ugly right now! Uh, Molly, I think he loves you no matter what because you put a spell on him! Well, I didn't mean to. It was just sort of a backfire spell, but whoopsie. Um, I'm really sorry, Jack, but we can't, we can't be boyfriend-girlfriend. Wait, what? What'd you just say to me? Um, we can't be boyfriend-girlfriend? Then I... I'm going to have such a broken heart that I'm going to need to explode all the broken even. <laughs> uh, Daisy, there's only one thing to do. Run! Molly! Are these boys going to follow us home? I don't know. I hope not. Meet me at my science lab. We'll try to fix this. Good plan. Molly, go to the dance with me and I'll give you a loan. Do you work at the bank even? Of course I do! <laughs> I'm a mortgage lender. You could have a brand new house. No, I don't need a new house! But I want to take you to the dance! <sighs> oh my gosh. That was so far to run, Daisy. How'd you beat me? Because I didn't have an entire town of boys chasing me. That's how. I can't believe what a mess you've made of everything, Molly. <sighs> I know. I don't do my homework. I sleep in past my alarm so I miss the school bus. I set bad spells, and then when I reverse them, the whole world explodes. Pretty much, Molly. But according to my calculations, I should be able to reverse everything well without too many mistakes. See, so you don't know how to do it either. Yes, I do. I'm just trying to unravel your giant mess. Molly, there you are. I've been looking everywhere for you. Oh, Luke, the world's gone crazy out there. Yeah. Crazy for you, Molly, because you're just so special, and and I I I, I I'm tongue tied around you. Wait, what? I thought you didn't want to take me to the dance. No, I I'm in love with you. You, you are, Molly. That's just the spell talking. Now I think it's really Luke. Molly, you know it's not. I didn't want to take you to the dance before your backfired spell. Oh, who cares? Who cares about a spell or a wrong spell or a right spell? You've put a spell on my heart, Molly, and I'm going to love you forever. Oh, <laughs> well, um, okay. Uh, Daisy, we're not going to reverse the spell. What do you mean we're not going to reverse the spell? Molly, snap out of it. I can't. I'm too busy gazing into Luke's beautiful eyes. Molly, he doesn't really love you. It's just a spell. It'll never be true love. You'll be living a lie. I don't care, Daisy. I'm going to go to the school dance with Luke, and I'll do anything to do it. So you only want Luke to take you to the school dance because he's under a spell, not because he actually likes you? I don't even know you anymore, Molly. I can't believe I'm about to say this, but... <sighs> Luke, I can't go to the school dance with you. What? No! My heart! It's broken! <laughs> I didn't do this, Molly. This is all you're doing. Now, the spell is going to be reversed. All I have to do is say these simple words and program it into my computer, of course. Alakazam! Alakazoom! My sister's spells are done by a noob! Really? That's the spell? Yes, Molly, that's the spell. Luke? Luke, are you okay? 
I feel kind of weird. Oh, this has been a very long day. Do you need a glass of water? Uh, I'll get you one. Don't hate me, please. Hate you? No, I don't hate you, but why'd you cast a spell on everybody? My brain hurts. Um, well, this is embarrassing and don't hate me! I already said I'm not going to hate you. What's going on, Molly? Oh, look. I could get a job as a scientist. This would be awesome. Daisy, no one cares about your job search. Sorry, I'm just saying I'm overqualified. Uh, Luke, so do you hate me? No, Molly. But you cast a spell on me and everyone else in town. That wasn't very nice. It's because I wanted to go to the dance with you and you kept asking everyone else. My heart was breaking. Oh, Molly. This spell made me realize something. Do you hate me? No, how many times do I have to say it? I don't hate you. I actually really like you. Like, I think I might be in love with you. Say what? I didn't see that one coming. Neither did I, Marley. Neither did I. Uh, I was wondering, um, do you want to be my girlfriend? Really? Or is this still a spell? No, according to my calculations, Marley, um, the spell was broken. Daisy, you're on a shopping website. I know, but I checked before I got on you. Look at these pants. Aren't they cute? Daisy! I already did my job, Molly. Uh, so Molly, what do you say? Will you, will you be my girlfriend? Um, uh... Of course I will, Luke! <gasps> this is like the best day ever. Wait a minute! Does being your girlfriend mean you're still taking Sarah or Brittany to the dance? No, silly. <laughs> Means I'm taking you to the dance. Yahoo! Then my answer is yes. Oh my gosh, my sister has a boyfriend. Luke, you're the cutest boy in the whole school. The cutest boy. Huh, what, what? Because today is the first day of being boyfriend and girlfriend at school with Luke. I can't wait to announce it to everyone. But first, I have to get dressed. What should I wear? What should I wear? What should I wear? I have to look so cute today. Oh, look at these jeans. They have little hearts on them. That's kind of perfect because my heart is so full of love for Luke. Let's see, does this match? Oh yeah, I look adorable, I look styling, I look ready to announce that I'm Luke's girlfriend. Riley, why are you awake before 6.30? Are you crazy right now? Who are you even? Because obviously you're not Molly getting out of bed this early. Nope, I'm definitely your sister. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up! Oh, Molly, why are you jumping on me, you cray cray? Today is the first day of being boyfriend and girlfriend at school, of course, so that's why I'm super excited and I have to get up. Okay. Yeah. I'll be up in a minute, Molly. Uh, at least you're not excited. It's pizza day. Wait, it's pizza day too? Holy guacamole! This day couldn't get any better! Oh, hey, Luke. Oh, hey, Sarah. Um, sorry that I changed my mind about taking you to the school dance, but Molly's my girlfriend now and... Wait, what? I thought I heard this really weird rumor that she was your girlfriend, but I can't believe it's actually true. Your boyfriend, girlfriend with Molly? Ugh, she's not even popular. I know, but she's my best friend and we get along and we both love pizza and Roblox and um, we both laugh when she farts. I mean, it's just a match made in heaven. Ugh, you know she only wants to be with you because you're popular, right? So she can be popular too. Wait, what? There's my boyfriend, Luke! <laughs> and he's talking to Sarah? Oh no, he's gonna dump me for her. Oh my gosh! I knew he wasn't over her! I knew he'd want to take her to the school dance! <laughs> my heart's broken! Molly? Molly! Molly, I can't come into the girls' bathroom! Come on, I'll get detention if I go in there! Come out, tell me what's wrong! My life is over! I thought Luke loved me! <laughs> he'd rather take Sarah to the dance! <laughs> oh, there's Daisy! Daisy, 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 Daisy! What? I just got in the door. What is it? It's Molly. She's super upset. She ran into the girl's bathroom and I can't go in the girl's bathroom, but you can, so we have to talk to her. Why is she super upset, Luke? Because it's all my fault. I was talking to Sarah and she saw us. Oh, don't tell me now you're taking Sarah to the dance again. No, 
Molly's my girlfriend. I'm taking Molly. And Sarah just was trying to fill my head with nonsense, but I know she's a liar. Well, that's good. But why is Molly upset? I already said because she saw me with her and, and, and she thinks I'm going to dump her or something. Oh, I get it now. Yeah, you're totally in trouble now. Will you talk to Molly, please? Ah, <sighs> okay. I'll go talk to her. As long as I'm not late for math class, I have a very important test today. Thank you, Daisy. Thank you so much. My life is over. Molly? Oh, go away, Daisy. I don't even want to talk to you right now. Molly, we need to talk with sisters. It's what we're here for. I thought we just fought all the time. Isn't that what you're here for? And to annoy me. No, Molly. Not to annoy you. Uh, to be an amazing sister who listens to you. Besides, I have a message from Luke. I don't want to hear it. Don't even tell me it. It's going to be bad. It's going to say, I dump you, Molly. Actually, quite the opposite. He's worried about you, Molly. He is? Yeah. He doesn't want to dump you. He, he knows Sarah's full of it. Really? Yeah, you know, Sarah, talk, 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 and all that comes out is garbage. Yeah, she really is rude and mean and sort of a bully, right? Most of the time, that's right. But he still loves you, Molly, and he still wants to take you to the dance and be boyfriend, girlfriend. Molly, you finally came out of the girls' bathroom. I brought your favorite pizza. Oh, Luke, you're the sweetest. Molly, I'm going to love you forever. Someday I'll probably marry you. Probably? What do you mean, probably? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, oh boy, I just, I keep messing this up today. Oh, being your boyfriend's kind of hard work. Well, get used to it. It's almost time for lunch, and that means Luke's gonna pick me up. We're having Starbucks together. I think he's the sweetest. Hey, Molly, are you ready to go to lunch? Uh, yeah, I'll be right there. I just have to log out from work. So, uh, Molly, um, I'm gonna need you to buy a really pretty white dress from your job. Wait, what? Why? Those are like $500 here. I can't afford that and rent. Well, uh, well, uh, I'm kind of nervous to ask you this, Molly, but, um, you're gonna need the dress if you want to marry me. Say what? Please! Molly, I'm so in love with you. Marry me! Marry me! <laughs> oh my goodness, Luke! Of course I'll marry you! I've been waiting for this day since... Well, we were boyfriend-girlfriend ten years ago. I know. Yay! She's gonna marry me. She's gonna marry me. Are you gonna sing to me at our wedding? Maybe. Would you like that? Uh, no. Well, at least my new bride is going to be honest. <laughs> wow, Molly, you look beautiful. I can't believe it's your wedding day. I know, but I'm just a little nervous because the wedding was supposed to start, well, right now, and Luke's still not here. You know Luke. He's always ten minutes late. He's been that way since you guys dated in high school. But this is his wedding day. Well, I still get paid whether he shows up or not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're going to get paid. He's not going to show up. We're not going to get married. Molly, he's going to show up. Don't you worry. Oh my gosh. I'm late, I'm late, I'm late for my own wedding. Oh. Whoa. Molly, you look beautiful. See, I told you he'd show up, Molly. Luke, you look so handsome. I'm sorry I'm late. <laughs> you know me. Yep, always oh, ten minutes late. You'll be ten minutes late to your own funeral. Okay, can we get on with this ceremony? I do have a funeral next, and I gotta get moving. I think the dead person won't mind if you're a little late. It's not like they're going anywhere. <laughs> oh, Molly, always the comedian. Okay, this is gonna be the fast version. Luke, do you take Molly to be your wife? I do. Molly, do you take Luke to be your husband? I do! Forever, never, 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 never! Even when you're ten minutes late! Oh no, she's gonna sing. Then I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride, or whatever. Mm -hmm. Oh wow, Molly, I can't believe it! We're married! And now for the honeymoon! Where are we going? We're gonna go over to Brookhaven Lake! Seriously? That's all we're going to? Yeah, is, is that not good? Oh, it'll be perfect, Luke. I thought we were going to Hawaii, but, you know, 
know, you can start off our marriage with a little bit of disappointment. Seriously, Molly? <laughs> I'm just kidding. But you gotta walk since it, I didn't want to go there. Molly, you're running my car into the wall. Oh, Molly, why are you trying to run me over? Okay, this might not work out. We may need to get a divorce. Are you serious? No, I'm just kidding, but I really don't want to walk there. Too bad, I was expecting Hawaii. Today I'm going to the water park. Okay, I have to get changed because um we're gonna be leaving for the water park any minute now. I know that Molly and Bookie are getting ready to go because Bookie spent the night last night and it was so much fun. Like seriously, we had the best sleepover ever. But now we're doing our morning routine so we can get ready for the water park. So let me see what should I wear, guys. I'm just gonna like go in here and see if there's anything good for me to wear to the water park. Oh my gosh! <laughs> okay, <laughs> <There. laughs> I like was wearing my pants for a minute and I'm like, wait a minute, what? What is going on? Okay, what about this one? Oh, that's adorable. I like that bathing suit. But what about this one? Oh, that's adorable. <gasps> I really like that one. Oh, this one's super cute too. Oh my gosh. I could not decide what bathing suit I actually want to wear. Oh, this one's like a little bit too crazy, I think, for the water park. Oh, I've decided between this one and this one. Uh, okay, I'm going to go with this one today because I think it's really adorable. And I just really like it. I think it goes good with my pigtails and everything. I wonder if Molly and Brookie are ready to go yet. <coughs> Molly, get out of bed! Molly, Molly, Molly! Huh? What? No. I don't want to go to school today. I don't want to go to school. Molly, get out of bed right this instant! I thought you were getting ready! Okay, where's Brookie? She's probably in the bathroom, right? Brookie? Are you so Brookie? Sorry, I was just kind of tired still, so uh, I was laying in bed. Don't either of you take this for serious? I mean, we're going to the water park today. This is going to be amazing. <laughs> Molly, get out of bed. I don't want to go to school. I don't want to go to school. <laughs> Molly thinks she's going to school today. Molly, we're going to the water park. Huh? What? What? The water park? What? What? Whoa! Molly, oh my goodness, are you okay? Huh, what? No, I'm still sleeping. <laughs> OMG, Molly, you're the only person I know on the planet that literally could be sleeping after she fell off the bed. Oh, yeah, yeah. You're gonna miss the water park. Okay, I'll be there later. Molly, seriously, wake up! All right, all right, I'm awake. I'm awake, but seriously, I don't want to go to school. Molly, today is not a school day. Today is water park day. And we have to do our morning routine. Get up. OMG, I forgot that it was water park day. Seriously, I thought it was um go to school day and I didn't want to go. That's because you always get detention. Yeah, sort of. Brookie, do you want to get out of bed? Yeah, I want a minute. It's just this bed is so comfy. It's way more comfy than my bed at home. You have to wake up. Wake up, wake up, wake up. We're going to the water park. We're going to the water park. Well, Marty, all of a sudden you have lots of energy. <laughs> okay, okay, I'm up. <sighs> so what do we do first? Wait, Daisy, did you wear that to bed? No, we've been up for like three hours already. Come on, we have to get ready. All right, hold your horses or whatever. I don't have any horses, Molly. I know, it's just a saying. It means... Relax, Daisy. We're going to go to the water park. Don't worry. Okay. Well, the first thing you guys should do is put on your bathing suits. Good plan. All right. Let's see. Which bathing sh suit should I wear? Um, I'm trying to see which ones I have. Oh, this one's kind of cute. This. Oh, this one's perfect. Yeah, this is totally me. I really like this swimsuit. Oh, Molly, that one's really cute. Well, I have to take a shower first because... um. I went for a jog last night, and I have to take a shower today. Oh, I took one last night. Me too, but we'll wait for you, Bookie. All right, guys, thanks. La, 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 la. rub a dub dub three ducks in a tub. <laughs> Rookie, I hear you singing in the shower. Oh, 
Yeah, I always sing in the shower. P I G G Y, a piggy is after me. P I G G Y, a piggy won't you set me free? I love that song. Now all I have to do is brush my teeth and I'll be ready to go. Brookie, hurry up, we're ready to go. Sorry, clean teeth are really important, Molly. I'm coming. Oh wait, I still have to put my bathing suit on too. Oh man, I gotta brush my teeth really quick. Oh, this one is so adorable. I love it. I look perfect for going to the water park. Okay guys, let's go. Molly, Daisy, where, where are you guys? Hello? Hello? Oh, they must be downstairs. Guys? Guys, where where are you? <laughs> oh my gosh, they went to the water park without me. How rude. Surprise, here we go. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys totally pranked me. <laughs> you took so long in the bathroom. We're like, we're going to prank her and make her think that we actually left for the water park without her. You guys are so funny, aren't you? Come on, guys, we're gonna miss out. Look, it's already looking like it's gonna rain. What? Oh, look at those storm clouds. No! It's okay, I saw on the weather today that it's supposed to pass us right on by, so it'll be fine. Let's just get our bags and get going. Well, if it rains while I'm at the water park, I'm gonna be so annoyed. Well, if it rains at the water park, <laughs> it won't really matter because you'll already be wet from being in the pool, so you'll just get wet from the rain. Uh, yeah, you kind of have a good point there. <laughs> you guys are funny. All right, let's go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We forgot something very important before we leave. Molly, we're gonna, we're gonna miss the water park today. Ugh, you're being so annoying. No, we forgot something really important about our morning routine. Well, Brookie took a shower. You and I brushed our teeth. Wait, did you brush your teeth? Uh, Molly, ew, go brush them. What? No. I don't, I don't want to brush my teeth. I want to get going. Ew, Molly, that's pretty gross. But I need to tell you something. No, Molly, brush your teeth first. Fine, I'll go brush my teeth. But then you have to listen to me. Okay, now where's my toothbrush? <laughs> Done. Okay, can I tell you what I wanted to say now? Yes, Molly, why is it that we can't leave for the water park? We forgot to eat breakfast. Oh, yeah, I was wondering why my stomach was growling. <laughs> Silly. <laughs> we should eat breakfast. I know the perfect thing to eat. Follow me. I'm gonna have a nice, healthy piece of food. <laughs> nah, waffles are much better. Ew, Molly, you can't just eat that all the time. You should have something healthy like an apple. Pookie, what's it gonna be? Healthy or unhealthy? Um, uh, uh. Brookie, you definitely want to eat this waffle. Pookie, you definitely want to eat this apple. Waffle. Apple. Waffle. Waffle! Oh my gosh, I don't feel hungry anymore. Brookie, you've got to eat something. How about she has a waffle with apple on top? Um, yeah, that sounds like a great idea. Um, first I'll eat the waffle and then... Ooh, you guys have banana? That sounds good too. No, you said waffle with apple! Well, I think I want banana instead, if that's okay. Yeah, she can have whatever she wants, Molly. Don't be rude. Okay, I guess you can have some banana if you really want to. But I just think you should have a second waffle. Molly, she wants to eat a banana, Jeepers. Ooh, this looks so delicious. Mmm. Told you, eating healthy is the way to be. Yeah, except for waffles are so delicious. Now that our tummies are all full, are we ready to go to the water park finally? Um, well, sort of. But I'm still eating more waffles. Molly, you've eaten, like, four of the waffles. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> I was really hungry. Molly, quit eating the waffles. It's time to go. Okay, fine. Let's go. Ah, this is the life. Yeah, tell me about it, Molly. Totally. I'm so relaxed. Good day at the water park. Yeah, it's pretty amazing. My two best friends, one on either side of me at the water park, could life get any better? I don't think so. I really don't. Yeah, me either. Hey, except for maybe if we went down some water slides. I love that idea. But first, snacks. Molly, we just ate breakfast. Yeah, Molly, you're hungry already. Hey, I can't help myself. <laughs> I love snacks. Molly, first some water slides. Then we'll get some snacks, okay? 
All right, fine. Brookie, are you coming down the water slides too? Absolutely. This is going to be so much fun. Okay, who is going to go down the slide first? Me, me, me. No, me. I'm the bravest one. Really? I think I'm pretty brave too. No, no, no. I'm the bravest one. Well, let's go by who's the oldest. Oh, well, that's definitely me then. Oh my gosh, look at I think we are going to get a storm. No, it's just turning nighttime because it took us so long to get here today. Well, the oldest one is Brookie Cookie, so she gets to go first. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, I'm so excited. Okay, here I go. Oh, I've got to work up the nerve to do this. You said you were the bravest one. Okay, yeah, I'm the bravest one. I'm brave. Hey, Molly. Hey, Daisy. Uh, what are you doing at the water park today? Um playing on the water slides and in the pool what about you yeah i sort of it's just ugh, i just i don't know i i thought they were gonna have hamburgers and they only had hot dogs here for snacks whoa that's terrible yeah but at least they have water slides right uh yeah bye see you at school she's so sad that they didn't have hot dogs i would be too though they better have cupcakes molly your next oldest just go but I'm talking about something serious. It's the snack shop. Molly, no one cares about the snack shop. Ooh, that made me think of cupcakes. Go down the slide, Molly. Oh, but I'm thinking about the cupcakes. Oh, they sound so delicious. Okay, Molly, whatever. I'm going down there. Hey, it's not your turn. Daisy, what? Daisy! Bye, Molly! Okay, that's it. I'm going. I'm going. Whoa! Wait a minute. Uh, why am I not in the slide? Something weird is happening. Okay, there we go. Whoa! <laughs> oh my gosh, this one's so cool! Whoa! Whoa! Okay, where am I? Where am I? Whoa! 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 You're the same place that we are, Molly. Uh, we didn't go down through the the hole of the water slide. Wait, what? It's broken? I want my money back. One star review. Okay, Karen, calm down. <laughs> Karen. <laughs> Daisy, are you just going to sit there all day? Or you're going to go down the hole. I'm I'm afraid to. What if it's broken, Molly? Uh, I think we should go down there anyway. I mean, it's starting to get really dark. The water park will close soon, and, and we can't be stuck here forever. Okay, who's brave enough to go first? Not me. Not me! Yo, it, Molly. Ugh, fine. Whoa! No, this part's not broken. Just jump down here. Whoa! Oh, my gosh. Oh my gosh, it might be broken. Now you tell us that. Nope, it's not broken. <laughs> Wee! Come on, Brookie. Brookie? Oh! <laughs> that was so much fun, Molly. Come on, Daisy, you can do it. Here I come, ready or not. Whoa! Oh, Daisy. <laughs> Wait till the end, Daisy. You're going to freak out. Here she comes, Molly. Wow! <laughs> that was so much of fun. <laughs> totally. Hey, did you just hit my friend with the pool noodle? Ouch, yes he did. Rude! I'm telling on you. I'm telling. Brookie, are you okay? Yeah, I think so. Oh, that really hurt. I think maybe he just came down the side. I'm not sure he hit it with a pool noodle. It looked like a pool noodle to me. We should probably get out of the way of the slide, though, just in case. Yeah. Do you guys want to have a snack now? Already, Molly? Yeah, it's dinner time. I'm starving. Okay, fine, I guess. Woo! A snack! I'll meet you over there. Seriously, all she ever thinks about is her stomach. I know, but I love her just the way she is. Oh, Brookie, that's so nice. Now let's go get some cupcakes! <laughs> Bad. My stomach is really hungry. I wonder if Daisy's making breakfast. I hope so. Uh, Daisy! Daisy! Daisy, where's breakfast? What do I look like, your chef? Actually, I was thinking you looked like, well, my, um, maid. Well, I'm not cleaning or cooking for you. But Daisy, I'm starving. Come on. Uh, sorry, Molly, but we're out of groceries. If you want to get in the car, we can go down to Whole Foods and get something. 
Okay, fine, let's go. I can't believe our town got a Whole Foods. I know what you mean, Molly. Such healthy options now. Well, <laughs> Daisy Cheaper, she like ran right into the, the lamppost. Where'd you learn how to drive? Um, zombie driving school. Uh, Daisy, this is a healthy option, but right next door there's a McDonald's. I vote we go to McDonald's. Absolutely not, Molly. We're gonna buy some groceries. Come on. Fine. Wow, this Whole Foods is super nice. I know, I'm just so glad that Blacksburg finally got one. Alright, let's look for the, the uh, brain burgers, because that's what I want for breakfast. A brain burger sandwich. Um, Molly, I'm not sure they cater to zombies here. What are you talking about? It's Whole Foods. They have everything. How about some low rows with some almond milk? Ew, I'm a zombie. Of course I don't want to eat that. Gross. Well, it looks like Whole Foods doesn't have any zombie food. Well, I guess we got to go to McDonald's. Absolutely not. But there is a Dunkin' Donuts. We could go over there. Besides, I think our best friend Bookie just got a job there. She did? <laughs> well, then she's buying us breakfast. Oh, McDonald's. How I love thee! Let me count the ways! They don't make brain sandwiches, though. Ah, the McGriddle is about the same thing. <laughs> um, okay, whatever you say, Molly. Alright, here we are, Dunkin' Donuts. I wonder if they have a brain donut. Good morning, welcome to... <gasps> Molly! Daisy! Oh my gosh, you, you guys are coming to see me, and it's only my second day of working here. Well, what do you think of it? Do you like working here? I love it. Um, plus, I get to eat all the free donuts that I want. Uh, you better go for a run after work, or you're going to be like the fattest worker ever if you eat that many donuts. Molly, don't be rude. Okay, um, what what do you have today? Well, I'm just cooking up some um, donuts in the back. Do you have any brain donuts? Um, I know you guys are zombies and stuff, but we don't serve anything that has brains in it. Did they just say they wanted a brain donut? Oh, I can't believe that we actually have zombies in my town. Wait till I tell everyone at school. We just moved here like over the summer and we haven't even started school yet and we already have a new bully. O-M-G. Oh, there's a bully no matter what school we go to. I mean, we can't help that we're zombies. You are the ugliest people I've ever seen. Well, we also happen to be zombies, and I think I'm beautiful. What's your name, anyway? I'm... Ugh, why am I going to tell you my name? Her name is Sarah, and, well, she sort of bullies everybody. I'm sorry, guys, we don't have any brain donuts, but, um, we do have, like, chips, yogurt, oatmeal. Um, all right, I... I, I don't know. I'm... I... Uh, what should I get, Daisy? Can you hurry up? You're holding up the line and I like so want my latte. God, you're so annoying. Okay, I'll I'll have um I'll have a latte uh and also a yogurt. Good choice, Molly. That's a pretty happy um choice in the morning. Actually, no, 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 no. I want a cappuccino. <laughs> Molly, I knew you were gonna say that, so I already got you the cappuccino. Your yogurt will be right up if you want to go take a seat. Okay, Daisy, place your order and then you can come um, sit by me. Even though you're my annoying sister. Molly, I'm not that annoying, Jeepers. She really is rude. Uh, you're just as annoying. You're both annoying because you're zombies. I can tell already that this bully is going to be a thorn in my side. <sighs> if she's not careful, I'm going to eat her brain. What did you just say? Molly, why did you have to say anything? Because this girl's a bully. She's starting to annoy me. I said, if you're not careful, this zombie is going to eat your brain. Ugh, zombie wants brains. Molly, that's terrible behavior with a West one. Give me your brains. Oh, crazy zombie. I'm calling the management. Molly, stop that. She's gone. I really do want some brains, though. I'm pretty hungry. Molly, sit over there by yourself if you're going to act like that. Fine. Okay, I will. Oh, my gosh, Molly. If my manager comes in here, he's really rude. And, 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 and I, I don't know what's going to happen, but you probably will never be allowed back in Dunkin' Donuts. That's okay. I like McDonald's better anyway. Hey, I work here. 
Don't, don't be rude. Sorry, I'm just having a bad day. And Sarah's the reason. Molly, don't pay any attention to her. She's just a bully. You know how to deal with bullies. Yeah, eat their brains? Molly, we are good zombies. We don't eat people's brains. But I'm starving and I'm bored. Molly, I mean it. Yeah, Molly, you can't just eat a bully's brains. But I'm a zombie. Molly, try to make friends with her. Okay, I'll try, but no promises. Uh, Sarah, Sarah. Oh, it's a zombie. Stay away from me. Um, no, I want to be your friend. We can be friends. There is no way that I'd ever be friends with the likes of you. Hey, look, we're good zombies. We don't need brains. I mean, well, I, not often. S sometimes, like, we will, like, order, like, a cow brain. Oh, that's disgusting. I know, but, you know, we don't eat human brains, okay? Sarah, look, uh, how about we have this little agreement between us? I don't think so, loser. Uh, if you're nice to me and don't bully me, then I'll eat the brains of any person you want once a month. You know, anybody that annoys you. Can you eat your own brain? Because you're annoying right now and you stink like a nasty zombie. What? Now I think I smell good. Ew, you smell. Stay away from me. I'm going to tell everybody at school you smell. Smell, smell. <laughs> you're so mean, Sarah. You're so mean. Daisy, do you think Molly's doing okay with making friends with Sarah? I mean, it's been a long time. Well, I mean, you're about the only friend she has, Bookie. And she's only known you for three months. Trust me, she'll mess it up somehow. Aw, life must be hard as a zombie. It is sometimes, but I just focus on my studies because I'm going to be a scientist someday. Wow, a zombie scientist? Never heard of it. Me either, I'm going to be the very first one. And I'm a girl. <laughs> wow, that's amazing. Maybe we should go check on Molly, though. I'm a little worried. Ah, uh, yeah, I think that's probably a good idea. Mmm, that's good. Uh, Molly, what are you doing? Um, just eating some rat brains out of the dumpster. Ew, oh my gosh, Molly, that's gross. Sorry, I'm a zombie and it makes me feel better. Molly, you don't need to eat rat brains from the dumpster in order to feel better. What happened? Mm, let me just finish this last bite. Molly, stop eating that. That's gross. Oh, sorry. Didn't mean to offend you by being myself, which is a zombie. Oh, boy. It didn't go well with Sarah, did it? No, not at all. Oh, Molly, I'm sorry that she's being a bully. Did you at least try to be your friend? Yeah, I even offered to eat the brains of someone that annoyed her. Oh, boy, Molly. You have a lot to learn when it comes to making friends. Well, I better learn before tomorrow because it's time to go back to school. Don't worry, Molly. I'll be your friend no matter what. Unless you try to eat my brain and then we have to break up. <laughs> Don't worry. I'll just keep eating these delicious rat brains. Mm, they are delicious. Ugh, having zombies as best friends takes a lot of getting used to. I'd like everyone to read what's on the board, please. Turn to page 370 in your textbooks. No talking, no passing notes. Okay, Mrs. Smith, I won't talk or pass notes. Oh, wait a minute, I'm talking right now. Does anybody get attention? No, Daisy, just turn to 370 in your textbook, please. Molly, would you like to wake up and join the rest of the class, please? Huh? What? Nah, I'm gonna go back to sleep. Molly, you're gonna get a week's worth of detention. Open your eyes and open your book, please. Huh, okay. Um, but Mrs. Smith, I, I forgot my book in my in my locker because I can't even think straight. It's like my brain is mush. Molly, quit making excuses. You're not only gonna get detention at school, you're also gonna get grounded at home. I know, but I just don't feel good. 
Oh, Marnie, quit trying to fake being sick just so you can lay on the nurse's cot all day and not do any of your schoolwork. Oh, really? My head feels like it's going to explode. I don't feel good. C can I go to the nurse, Mrs. Smith? Molly, are you making this up right now? Whoa, you don't look so good, Molly. I think your sister might really be sick, Daisy. I really am sick. I need to go to the nurse. Okay, Molly, you're excused. I hope you feel better. Don't forget, you're going to have to do your homework when you get back. I know. Thanks. Oh, Molly, you're back again to skip class. Ah, <sighs> what can I do for you? Miss Kuhn, I don't feel good. Yes, yes, I've heard you say that before, but usually you're just fine. No, Miss Kuhn, seriously, my head feels like it's going to explode. My mouth all hurts and stuff. Your mouth hurts? Seriously? Were you eating too much candy? No, I, I just, I don't really feel good. I, I want to go home. Well, why don't you sit right there and I'll take a look and see what's going on. Okay, Molly, I just need you to say ooh or ah. Ah! Oh, wow, it looks like your tonsils are the size of tennis balls. I definitely have to call your mom. Yep, yep, yep. It seems you also have a fever. You're going to need to see the doctor. I knew I didn't feel good. Can I lay down on the magic cot? You sure can, Molly, but I'm pretty sure it's not going to make you feel any better today. I don't care. I just want to lay down. I don't feel good. Like, at all. <coughs> Molly, Molly, wake up. I'm here to take you to the doctor. <coughs> Molly, huh, what? Oh, Mom, I'm so glad to see you. I don't feel good. I want to go home. Oh, Molly, the nurse said that maybe we should go see the dentist, that there might be going something going on with your teeth or something, since your throat is all swollen. So we're going to go there. Now I'm going to stay here on the magic cot. I hate going to the dentist. <sighs> Molly, stop pretending you're sleeping. <whistles> Can't hear you, Mom. Sleeping. Molly, come on, you have to go to the dentist or you might not feel better and things might get worse. Worse? I don't see how much worse they can get, Mom. I feel terrible. Come on, it won't be bad, honey. I'll be right with you. Molly, seriously, get out of the bed. Okay, I didn't mean to lay down that time. My body just feels really tired, Mom. I know, Molly. Don't worry, everything will be okay. I don't wanna be here. I don't wanna be here. Molly, everything's gonna be fine. Don't panic, honey. Besides, <laughs> Dr. Moeller is going to make you feel so much better. Oh, hi there. We're waiting to see Dr. Moeller. Oh, sorry. He had an emergency, but I'm Dr. Payne, and I'll be taking care of Molly today. Are you serious right now? My doctor's name is Dr. Payne? That can't be good. Oh, yeah, I know, but it's with an E on the end, so it's not really Dr. Payne as in like, oh my gosh, this is going to hurt really bad. Your name is Dr. Payne, and you're a dentist. Well, actually, I think it's kind of funny, Molly. Don't you think it's kind of funny? No, Mom. It's not funny at all. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Just, she's a dentist, and her name is Dr. Payne. Mom. Okay, Molly. I can take you in now. Let's go. So tell me how you've been feeling, honey. Horrible. My, my, my um, school nurse said I have a fever, and... And I, I, okay, well, while you're telling me, I just need you to stand right here because I'm going to take an x-ray of your mouth and your head, okay? Will this hurt? No, not at all, Molly. Just stand right there. Very good. Now, it might make a loud noise, but don't worry. Everything's going to be fine. So, what else did you feel today? I felt, um, like a really bad headache and pain in my mouth. Oh, yeah, that sounds like maybe you have a tooth problem. Um, let's go see. Come on into my exam room and just go ahead and lay down. Now I'm going to need you to say, ah, nah, that's okay. I think I'll just keep my mouth closed. Your mom says you never keep your mouth closed. You chat, 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 chat. So I'm sure you can open your mouth one more time. Oh, I don't want to be here. It's okay, Molly. Everything's going to be just fine. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Oh my, is that a good oh my or a bad oh my? Um, well, I'm just gonna bring your mom into the room, okay? Why do I need my mom? Are things really bad? No, Molly, everything's gonna be fine. I just want to have a conversation with your mom. What is it, Dr. Payne? Is everything okay? Does she have a cavity? 
if you want to look at these x-rays over here, Laura, I can show you what's going on. Oh, wow, look at your teeth, Molly. These are the two problem teeth in the back. Those are called wisdom teeth, and well, they're starting to come through crooked and growing back into Molly's gums. They're very infected, which is why Molly has a fever. She's going to need surgery to remove them. Surgery? Are you kidding me right now? I can't have surgery? That sounds scary, no way. Well, they can't stay in there, Molly. They're infected, and they'll only get worse. Oh, Dr. Doctor Payne, you must be mistaken. My daughter doesn't need surgery. Yeah, I don't need surgery, Dr. Payne. You must not be a real dentist. Well, Molly, that's not very nice. Um, but my daughter is usually just fine. Like, she brushes her teeth. She, she's, she's really good about flossing and stuff. I mean, she eats too much candy, but no, no, that has nothing to do with it. It's just the way that some people's wisdom teeth come in and she is going to need the surgery. So I will give you the referral to the hospital so she can have it done. Mom, no, you, you can't let me have surgery. Are you sure about this, Dr. Payne? I mean, I don't really think she needs surgery. You sure you don't need to have your wisdom teeth out until you're like 18 or something, right? No, Laura, I'm afraid she really does need the surgery. Well, Molly, she says you need the surgery. Nah, she's full of it, Mom. She's full of it. I'm out of here. Molly, where are you going? You can't run away. Ugh, I don't feel so good. Molly? Molly? Molly! Mom, I don't feel so good. I'm really dizzy. Oh my gosh, Molly. The infection must be spreading. We have to get you to the hospital right away and have those teeth taken out. No! That sounds okay. I don't really care. I just, I don't feel good at this point. Uh, whatever. Oh, Molly. I can't believe my little baby's gonna have surgery. Ugh, you're super heavy. I can't even carry you anymore. Ow, Mom! You ran my head into the door! Sorry, Molly. But we need to get to the hospital straight away. Mom! I don't want surgery! Don't let them take me in there! I'm sorry, Molly. I don't want you to have surgery either, but it sounds like it's the only option. Mom! Does she really need surgery? I mean, she, she doesn't seem like she needs surgery, right? Um, Laura, she definitely needs surgery, I'm sorry to say. I'm sorry, Molly, they said you need surgery. Mom! Does she really need surgery? I mean, she doesn't really want to have it. Yes, for the 50th time, she needs the surgery! Now, would you step aside? I need to take your daughter in and remove these wisdom teeth. No, I don't want it! Mom! Mom! <laughs> Molly, it's going to be okay. I'm going to give you something to make you feel really happy and relaxed. It's called laughing gas, and you're gonna laugh. Did you eat bean burritos last night? Because I don't want you to fill up the room with farts. Um, no, that's not quite what laughing ga gas does. Now just hold still for one second. Ow! How are you feeling, Molly? <laughs> you have two noses. What? No, now you have no nose. <laughs> Everything in the world is funny. Everything in the world is funny! <laughs> Where's my baby? Where's my baby? Oh, there you are, Molly. Are, are you okay, honey? <laughs> um, Molly, are you all right? <laughs> this is TikTok Gold. Molly has anesthesia and she's acting like a Looney Tunes. <laughs> um, yes, it is normal that she would act a little loopy after she's had anesthesia. But she had the teeth taken out just fine and she should be feeling better in about mm, a week, I'd say. Does she have to stay here, doctor? No, just a couple of hours for observation, then she can go home. Does that sound good, Molly? <laughs> My sister's brain is totally scrambled. <laughs> I'm putting this on YouTube. I can't believe it, Daisy. I'm so disappointed. Whee! I love Mr. Meowzalad. He's so cute. Daisy, are you even listening? Well, I'm trying to listen, Molly, but Mr. Meowzalad is so cute, I can't hear anything you're saying. Well, hear this, Daisy. The slumber party that we're having tonight, it's canceled. <gasps> what, Molly? What are you talking about? No, it's not. Yeah, it is. I called Brookie Cookie. She's busy. She has plans with her family. What? And then I called Willow. 
She also has plans. Pretty much all of our friends have plans. Oh my gosh, Marty. We've been waiting to do this all weekend. I know. It's terrible, but it's just the way it is, Daisy. There's no sleepover. <laughs> That's the saddest thing I ever heard. I know. I think I need to go eat a cupcake. Hey, Molly. What's going on? Nothing, Dad. Oh, you seem so sad, Molly. Tell me what's going on. Well, you see, Daisy and I were really excited about having a sleepover tonight, but no one can come. What? No one can come to your sleepover? That would make me sad, too. Well, it is making us super sad. Really sad. Well, girls, there's always next weekend. But next weekend's so far away, Mom! Why can't anybody come over? I don't know, Molly, but it's probably because they have plans with their family. Why don't we have plans? Can't we go to Disney World? Uh, Molly, that's a little bit far of a drive. Yeah, Molly, that's pretty far. We could drive it or we could take an airplane. Um, we don't have tickets to take an airplane to Disney World, Daisy. Well, we could get some. That would cost a fortune. Well, um, I have, like, uh, two dollars in my bank account. Um, Molly, your allowance is not gonna cover plane tickets. Hmm, let me think about this. Wait a minute. I know. We could have a family slumber party. What? Really? I don't know about that. That might not be fun. What are you girls talking about? It's gonna be so much fun. I'm gonna make a bunch of treats. We can watch one of your favorite movies. You girls can camp out in the living room. Really? We're gonna have a family slumber party? Okay, this sounds super fun. Um, I think that I want to have something delicious made for me. Let me see what. Do, 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 do. Okay, we need potato chips, definitely. What else? Um, Mom, can you make me a grilled cheese and hot chocolate and um cupcakes and... Wow, Molly, that's a lot of stuff. Yeah, I know. Oh, a PB&J. Hmm, I'm gonna eat that. Is it like to just tide me over because I'm really hungry right now? Do, 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 do. Okay, for some reason, it's saying I'm too young to make a PB&J. Since when? I know exactly how to make a PB&J. Don't worry, Molly. I'm making lots of delicious treats. Oh, wow. Can I lick the batter bowl? Sorry, Molly. This has eggs in it. Oh! Daisy, let's go see if the brightly colored unicorn's on TV. Wait a minute. No! Let's actually go in the hot tub first. <laughs> this is going to be the best family slumber party ever. Ah, that feels amazing. Go to work. No, I don't think so. I'm having a slumber party. Daisy, where are you? Sorry, Marley. I was just watching Mom make some yummy treats. Ah, this is a life, Daisy. Yeah, I was kind of sad our friends couldn't come for the slumber party, but it seems like Mom and Dad are going to have an awesome family slumber party with us. Yeah, it's going to be totally cool. Ah, I'm so glad we got this hot tub. Me too, Molly, me too. Girls, please come into the kitchen. Okay, coming. Well, I was stuck in the hot tub. Yeah, Mom, what is it? Um, I have some laundry I need you girls to do. Mom, you don't do laundry at a slumber party. But Molly, I, I, I always do my laundry on this day. Mom, you have to wait till tomorrow because, uh, laundry is not fun. Oh, I don't think it's that bad, Molly. You like having clean clothes, right? Mom, this is going to be the worst slumber party ever. Okay, Molly, we'll do laundry tomorrow. Oh, thank goodness. Did you hear that, Dad? Mom wanted us to do laundry. Ah, there's a ghost in our house! Ah! Holy moly, that was crazy. Wait, where are those cookies? I want one of those. Mom, it won't let me have a cookie. Okay, yeah, it did. No, it didn't! I don't know why, but I can't... Okay. <laughs> no, I don't want the whole... Oh, my goodness. <laughs> there! Finally, a potato cookie! Mom, can I have a cookie? 
Molly, why are you standing on the counter? It was the only way I could eat this cookie. Yum, 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 yum. Ah, that was delicious chocolate chip, my favorite! Daisy, are you still in the hot tub? Mom's got chocolate chip cookies out of the tub all day. Maybe. Hey, Mom wanted me to do laundry. What? I did sleepover? Is he crazy? That's what I told her. You don't do laundry to sleepover, Mom. She's making all these delicious treats, though. Woo, Molly, cheeseburgers, cookies. Yeah, I think I'm going to have a cheeseburger, too. Um, I also cut up some watermelon. Wow! Mom, you're always invited to my slumber parties. What about me? I I'm super fun. Uh, Dad? Not, not really. Ah, another ghost is in our house! Oh my gosh, so many ghosts are getting in here today. I'm running away. Climbing up the bookshelf. Just kidding. <laughs> I can't decide what I want. A hamburger. That's a cheeseburger, Daisy. A cheeseburger with a cookie. Ooh, watermelon. Yeah, it's super hot today, so having a watermelon piece of watermelon is like the best. Molly, stop climbing on the table. Sorry, I'm just really excited. I ate all that sugar from the cookie and now I'm kind of crazy. Yum, 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 yum. Mmm, delicious! Okay, girls, uh, you girls want to watch a movie? I do! Come on, everybody, let's watch a movie! Oh, the brightly colored unicorn movie is on! Yes! Waiting for the rest of my family so we can watch a super awesome movie. Huh. Guys, hurry up! It's about to start! Ooh, I can't wait to watch this movie! It's gonna be amazing! Come on, Bob! Um, I'm just doing some laundry! But, but dear, you're not supposed to do laundry at slumber parties. Didn't you ever go to a slumber party when you were a girl? Um, yeah, it's just been a really long time. Well, you don't do laundry or dishes or anything else on the day you have a slumber party. Sheesh. Ooh, this movie looks really good. Remember the last time we watched a family movie? Yeah, <laughs> it was awesome. Really? What was it, dear? Um, uh... Dad, it was Frozen! No, it wasn't, Molly. It was Wally. Oh, yeah, it was Wally. Oh, I love that movie. That's so good. The brightly colored unicorn, the brightly colored unicorn. Mom, Dad. Yes, Molly? Yes, Molly? It was really sad that we weren't having a slumber party with my friends, but... I think having a family sleepover, a slumber party or sleepover is super awesome, too. Sounds like an awesome night to me. Me, too. Just maybe we could um, put a tent in the living room. Ooh, girls, that sounds like so much fun. I'll head out to the garage and see if I can find it. Really, Dad? You will? Yeah, I've seen the Brightly Colored Unicorn movie before. You have? Of course he does, Marley. He loves unicorns. <laughs> Girls, did you have enough of your treats? Yeah, Mom, they were delicious. Mama, you and Dad going to put a tent in the living room too? Probably, if your dad can find both of them. Oh my gosh, this is going to be so amazing. Hey, Toyo fans, it's me, Molly. And me, Daisy. Thanks so much for coming to our family slumber party. Yeah, it was so much fun. Ooh, I just had another idea. Mom, can we maybe put the tent in the backyard? Ooh, hmm. I think it's supposed to be warm enough tonight. I don't see why not. Yeah, this is awesome. Woohoo! Whoa, Dad set up our tent outside. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Look, I'm in my sleeping bag. <laughs> this is so cool. I can't believe that my sister and I are actually going to camp out tonight in our backyard. Look, there's a sleeping bag for me and a sleeping bag for Daisy. And, of course, um, the tent keeps us safe from, like, rain and all that stuff. So, whoa, I fell in the pool! <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Mom, look, Dad set up a tent for us! Whoa, Molly, that's so cool! Yeah, I thought so, too. Maybe I can find one for um you and Dad. That way you guys can sleep outside, too. Maybe, Molly... Come on in the pool. It feels awesome. Wow! This is so awesome. Molly, I can't believe it. We had an amazing family slumber party. Yeah, we totally did. Ah, nothing like a family slumber party. Hey, everybody, wait for me. Whee! 
Uh, Dad, you landed in the grass. <laughs> Whoops. Oh my gosh, I can look in the living room right now and see the brightly colored unicorn movie on TV. <laughs> That's why I hung the TV there, Molly, so you could see it while you were in the pool. Great plan, Dad, great plan. Hey, Toy Hero fans, don't forget to subscribe to the Toy Heroes channel where we put out awesome videos just like this one every single day. And we love you guys so much. You're the best fans in the world. Yeah, guys, you really are the best fans. We'll see you guys next time. Bye! Huh, it's the perfect day to sit here and do absolutely nothing. Hey, Molly, what's up? Oh, Brookie! I didn't know you were going to be around today. Yeah, I thought maybe we could hang out. Do you want to? Yeah, sure, I'll hang out. Let's ride bikes. Nah, I'm feeling really lazy today. I don't want to ride bikes. Oh, um, but I rode my bike here because I thought it would be really fun. It is like 90 degrees outside today. I am not riding bikes. Too hot. Oh, we could always go swimming in your pool. Yeah, that would be amazing, except for my dad just refilled it, and the water's freezing. I don't mind cold water. Well, you would mind this. It's shocking. Come on in, Brookie. Oh, hi, Brookie. I'm just watching adorable pig videos on YouTube. Oh, hey, DZ. I just came to hang out because it's summer vacay, and it's boring at my house. Well, it's not really boring here because we have tons of snacks. Molly, do you want to watch a movie in the air conditioning? Nah. I don't want to watch a movie. Molly, not to be rude or anything, but I've been noticing something. Every time Brookie comes over to our house, you never want to do what she wants to do. What? That's, that's not true. Look, we're doing what she wants to do right now, right? Just chill on the couch. Actually, Molly, I don't want to just lay here on the couch for my summer vacay. I wanted to ride bikes or go swimming or, or watch a good movie or something. Yeah, Molly, you're just nothing but a lazy bum all summer. Hey, that's rude! I can't believe my best friend and my sister would say something so mean. Well, Molly, if the shoe fits, wear it, diva. Me? A diva? I don't think so. Um, Molly, you're wearing your sunglasses inside. That kind of makes you a diva. Um, I just want to be fashionable. Cool, you know? Diva, diva, diva. If you don't stop calling me a diva, I'm gonna, I'm gonna... Guys, stop fighting. It's really frustrating that you guys fight all the time. I come over here to hang out with you guys and have fun and, well... <sighs> Molly, I have to tell you something. Okay, what is it? If you can't ever want to do anything I want to do, and it's just always about you, 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 then I don't know if we can be friends anymore. What? You would give up being my best friend? Well, you're not much of a best friend if all you ever do is be selfish, Molly. I'm not selfish. I mean, well, I guess I am kind of selfish. And also, summer vacation's not very fun when all you want to do is sit around and eat Doritos. Yeah, Molly, so what's it going to be? Um, um, well, I'll do whatever you want for 24 hours. And I'll see if I like the things you decide to do. Seriously? You'll give me 24 hours to do whatever we want? That sounds amazing! Uh, okay, well, I don't know how it could be more amazing than just chilling out on the couch and eating Doritos, but I guess we'll find out. Oh, this is gonna be good. Um, Bookie, can I see you over here? I wanna talk to you about something. Hey, no secrets! Molly, I'm just going to talk to Bookie only. What did you wanna tell me, Daisy? Molly is being such a selfish brat. I wouldn't blame you at all if you wanted to do things like have her take a mud bath, dress up like a giant banana for the whole town to see. <laughs> you know, fun stuff like that. Why would I be so mean, Daisy? It's not mean. It's just testing to see if she really will do whatever you want or if she's still the selfish person we think she is. Well, you do have a point. Um, well, there's only one way to find out. Quit whispering! I know it's about me! Um, well, um, okay, Molly. Well, you said I, you would do whatever I wanted to do for 24 hours. Yeah, so quit whispering and tell me! First, I want you to turn your phone upside down and be so ridiculously happy! 
I don't know if that's humanly possible. You just really irritated me. Molly, you promised. Our friendship is on the line. Ugh, okay. I'm so ridiculously happy! <laughs> Look at me! Happy, 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 happy! How's that? Whoa, that's a little creepy. I'm not used to seeing you like that, Molly. <laughs> I'm gonna go back on my computer. Have fun, you two! Okay, so what's the first thing we're gonna do? First, you're gonna dress like a giant banana and wave to everybody in town. Wait, what? Yeah, doesn't that sound like fun? I think it'll be hilarious. Everyone will be so cheered up by your banana costume. You aren't serious right now, right? Totally I am. Are you going to do it? Our friendship is on the line. Oh, I guess. I mean, I don't want to lose my friend. Well, how do I look? <laughs> like a giant banana. <laughs> See, you're already making me super happy. Oh, boy, I feel ridiculous. Oh, yeah, this is me too cold. Marley, say hi. Turn that camera off. I'm not, oh my gosh, I'm just running out of here. Running out of here. Molly, you know what would make this so much more amusing to everybody driving by? Ugh, I'm already dressed like a banana. What else do you want from me? You should do a little banana dance and sing a song. I don't know any banana songs. Um, think of one, Molly. Our friendship is on the line. I know, you keep saying that. I'm a little banana, but but banana. I'm a little banana, but but banana. OMG, is that Molly dressed up like a banana dancing? I'm a little banana, but but banana. I'm a little banana, but but banana. Um, Molly, don't look now, but um, Sarah's here. Sarah, I'm like what? She's the biggest school bully in the world. I'll never hear the end of this. <laughs> what are you doing? Working for a banana farm or something? You look ridiculous. I'm trying to keep my best friend happy. I am happy. I'm so happy. Well, see you later, losers and the banana. <laughs> loser banana. That's what I meant. You're a loser banana! Whoa, that was just rude. What? The police? Seriously? Excuse me, do you have a permit? A permit? A permit for what? A permit to be a banana dancing on this street. Uh, are you serious right now? You need to be a, a, a permit to be a banana. Actually, you do. In the town of Brookhaven, you can only be a banana on the street dancing if you have a permit. Oh boy, Molly, I think you just got a really big ticket. $500? $500? Are you kidding me? Are you talking back to me right now? Because I could make that ticket 600 banana. No, I'll just pay it. All of my life savings goes to being your friend now, Brookie. I hope you're happy. Um, yeah. I'm sorry, Molly. Maybe we should do something more fun than, um, than humiliating me as a banana on the street? Yeah, definitely that. Come on, let's go back to your house and we'll do something actually fun. Fun sounds like sitting on the couch and eating Doritos. No, Molly, something actually fun, like riding a bike or something. Ugh, fine, as long as I can take this banana suit off, I'm sweating. Okay, let's ride bikes. Okay, if that's what you wanna do, but ugh, this zipper seems to be stuck on this banana costume. Can you help me out of it? Sure, let me just see if I can get the zipper. Uh-oh, Molly, I can't get the zipper either. What, I'm stuck in this banana costume? Let me go see if I can get some scissors out of the kitchen. Oh my gosh, I'll have to cut myself out of this banana costume. Um, uh, Molly, the banana costume's rented. You can't cut it or it'll cost us $500. Really? I don't have another $500. I have this ticket for being a banana. Now I'm gonna get a, uh, I'm gonna have to buy this banana costume? Oh my gosh, this is the most ridiculous day ever. And everybody wonders why I want to be in charge of what we do. Well, um, um, maybe we could just like put some butter on you and you could slide out of it. Oh, I hate my life right now. I hate my life right now! Please have butter. Please have butter. Oh my god, we're out of butter! Oh no, how am I ever gonna get out of this banana costume? Well, I do have this leftover popcorn from the movies last night. That's pretty buttery. We could probably just smear the popcorn all over you and you could slide right out. Oh. My, 
gosh! Have I said I hated my life today? Have I said it? Kelly, don't eat the popcorn. We need that for the butter. I'm just hungry. I need something to eat, and I'm stressed out. Sometimes I stress eat. Oh, yeah, yeah, Molly. Okay, here we go. I'm going to rub all this popcorn all over me and... And... Ah, thank goodness! I'm out of the banana costume! Now, come on. Let's go ride bikes. I want to go lay on the couch. That was the worst day ever. Why are you making me dress like a banana anyway? It was just rude, and I didn't like it. It wasn't even fun. Molly, you promised for 24 hours. And okay, I admit, the banana idea was Daisy's. Wait, what? Yeah, she wanted to see if you were actually going to do things for me because she said you're very selfish. Well, are you happy now? Are you satisfied? I need to rub popcorn butter all over me. And I got a $500 ticket. Yes, Molly, now we're just gonna go have real fun together. Ugh, I don't want to, but I guess, because you're still my best friend and I don't wanna lose you as my friend. All right, come on, it's gonna be fun, Molly. Now, come on, put a smile on. You're, you're pushing me too far, Brookie. I don't wanna put a smile on. No, smile, ever! Whoa, Molly, your bike is so cool. I've never seen it before. That's because I hardly ever come out to ride my bike. Oh no, there's a police officer. Okay, I'm going downtown because I definitely do not need to get another ticket for something. Whee! Okay, I have to admit, this is actually kind of fun. I told you, Molly, I knew you were gonna love it. Well, don't let it go to your head. I'm sure I'll be tired soon enough and wanna go home and just eat Doritos. Um, well, we could go swimming if you want. We could go back and go to the um, pool or something. Um, yeah, why not? It's your 24 hours. As long as I don't have to go as a giant banana. Ugh, it's pretty hot. That water looks really refreshing. We don't have our bathing suits, Molly. Oh, yeah, that's true. We should probably just go home. Nonsense! We'll just jump in right with our, our regular clothes on. It'll be fine. Are you sure? Yeah, you go up the diving board and I'll go down the slide. Okay. <laughs> Whatever she wants for 24 hours, I have to say yes. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> oh, MG, that was so much fun. <laughs> attention, attention, girl in the pool. What? Who's that? Oh, no. Not the police again. Don't worry, Molly. You're not dancing and singing on the street as a banana anymore. I'm sure you can't get in trouble for not having a permit. Hi, officer. What's going on? What's going on is that you're in the community pool without proper attire. What? It's not like I'm swimming naked or something. I've got my clothes on. I know, but you're going to clog up all the filters in the community pool by wearing your shoes and clothes in. You're supposed to be wearing a bathing suit. No socks, no shoes. Go read the sign. Um, well, we didn't know, but she'll get right out. Yeah, see, I'm, I'm right out of the pool. Huh? So, um, wait, what's that? It's a ticket, and you have to pay it. $500? What? That's the cost of having all the threads from your clothes taken out of the pool filter. Have a nice day. Ugh, why is she saying have a nice day? She wrote me tickets for $1,000 today, and now you see why I sit on the couch and eat Doritos. But Molly, didn't you have fun? I mean, a little bit? Ugh. Yeah, I did. <laughs> Even if I got a bunch of tickets and look like a total fool in front of the school bully. Excuse me, you still look like a fool. Has she been standing there that whole time? Um, no, it looks like she's in her car, Molly, and driving the block just to see you get the ticket. Ugh, oh, Sarah! Well, at least we're still BFFs. Really, you still wanna be my best friend even though I've been really selfish? Yeah, Molly, after today and how devoted you were to me, there's no one I'd rather be my best friend. Oh, Brookie. Now, will you do the banana dance again? Are you serious right now? No, I'm not going to do the banana dance. Molly, I still have a few more minutes of my 24 hours. Oh, okay. I'm a banana, but, but, banana. I'm a, mama banana, but, but, banana. I'm a banana, but but banana. I'm a banana, but but banana. Hey guys, what's up? Today I am with some of my other.
other friends who are also subscribers, and we are trying to escape this nanny. Guys, she's so rude. Like, look at me. I have my pool floaty on because I was told that when I was at the nanny's, I could go in the swimming pool. But no, this grumpy old hag just said that we can't go swimming. And she even said we had to take a nap. What do I look like? Three years old? OMG. Okay, it says look for a code in this room to escape. Um, guys, it's like right here. 23, 23. All right, guys. Um, I need to help out my fellow Robloxians here and try to get out. Wait, okay. I put that in there. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, did the door open? <laughs> Beware. Hot lava. All right, this crazy old nanny, she's she's trying to keep me here forever. I don't think so. I'm going to the water park. I am. I am you crazy nanny. Who puts hot lava in their living room? That's just cray cray. Oh my gosh, guys. I have a huge tail, and I just feel like it's going to get in the way of me trying to escape. Oh, I was right. Oh, man. All right, I can do this. I can do this. I believe I can do anything. <laughs> Alright, that was just a little motivational song for you. She wasn't even wearing the giant mermaid tail floaty and she died. Oh god. Oh! Oh no! I died again. Alright. Alright guys, I can do this. Do you believe in me? I need you guys to believe in me. Hey, what's up? Hey Molly, are you trying to escape this crazy old lady nanny? Yeah, I totally am, Tiny. Oh man, I keep dying here though. I'm losing my head over this, this section right here. Oh, her name is Nanny K, in case you guys want to play this, Abby. What? All right, these are not evenly spaced, so you have to be very careful. If you make one wrong jump like that, you turn into lava. All right, guys. Oh, I know I'm going to be able to get through this. I just need, like, I need a cookie. <laughs> Do you ever just have a day where you need to eat a cookie? Yeah, that's today. Oh, I think it lets you save part of the way through. Yeah, because Nanny K, your obby is insane now. Yes! Now what's all this? Um, uh, uh, oh, look over here, guys. Some brightly colored shapes that apparently I don't think you can touch. Do not touch the brightly colored shapes! They are not for you to touch. All right, here we go. Oh, wait, I almost went the wrong way. That would have really stunk, right, guys? Since I already got past that point. Um, wait, so do I not? Okay, yeah, can't jump on those. What? Oh, the tail! The tail, it keeps getting me. Guys, have you hit the subscribe button yet? Please, guys, please hit subscribe. Um, I, I'm trying to get to a million subscribers. I know, it's a lot of subscribers, but come on, guys. Daisy's beating me on subscribers. That just is so sad. You guys love Daisy more than me? Are you kidding me right now? Oh, you cannot love my sister more than me. Look at me. Look at my smiling face. I'm so cute. All right. Um, guys, I, I want to talk to you guys about something that I think is kind of funny. Uh, so somebody has been putting out, like, like different fans have been putting out videos about how we haven't done face reveals yet. What are you talking about? There's my face right there. <laughs> oh, like my in real life face. Do you guys really want to see what my face looks like? Seriously? Do you? Well, I'm going the wrong way. Um, you guys, hit the subscribe button. And, um, maybe I'll do a face reveal. <gasps> Wouldn't that be amazing? After all these years, guys, I could do a face reveal. What? All right. Um, what are we doing now? I can't even tell. I think I can jump that. What do I look like? Grasshopper or something? <laughs> well, I do say Jiminy Cricket a lot. What? All right, I'm just, so far I'm doing pretty good. Just double jump it. Even though this pool floaty is getting a little annoying. I think it's adorable, don't you guys? Yes, it's like, it reminds me of summer. Oh, I love fall and Halloween, but I miss summer when I could go outside, go swimming, and no school. All right, where am I supposed to go now? Like, oh, what? This, this, this escape nanny K is weird. I mean, like. Um, uh, yeah, I went over here, but now where? Well, obviously not there. I just went flying through outer space. Oh, my God. 
gosh, I can't figure this out, Nanny K. Wait, oh my god, I thought it was gonna take me back to the beginning. I'm starting to get like really mad right now. Oh, uh, I think I have to jump up there, but it's like almost impossible. Ugh. Ah! Oh man, I'm just gonna die because I, I don't want to have to do that part all over again. <laughs> I don't think whoever made this obby uh, quite completed it, but you know, whatever. Maybe they're just learning how to make like games. Oh my gosh, I came so close that time. Now it's like a personal thing. Like I have to do this. All right, whatever. I'm just gonna jump back up here again. You ever have that happen like in an obby? Like, okay, whatever. I'm, I'm, I'm jumping off the edge. Whee! Um... We're like, the developer didn't quite make it, like, so you could escape. But then it becomes your personal mission to escape. Come on! I need to escape! I will escape this obby. I will. And when I'm done, I'm going to go to McDonald's, and it's going to be delicious. O-M-G. Let me out of here, please. See, it's like you have to jump over there. Am I going the wrong way or something? Like, has anybody passed this part right here? I feel like not. Oh, come on! Guys, I might just have to go, like... I don't know. Go a different way. I don't know. Like, this part is just... I don't think you can get past this part. I don't get it. Okay, maybe running and jump. Double jump! <sighs> Double jump! No, that didn't work. It just it just put me down here. Guys, I don't know. I don't what should I do? Comment below if you know what I should do, guys. Maybe maybe the floaty is just like slowing me down or something. I don't I don't know. I can do anything. I can do it. I believe I can do this. <laughs> maybe I can't. I don't know. Okay. Maybe I just like Ah oh, no! Is there like a skip the stage or something? Yes! Oh my god, guys! I made it! Where's the save button? Holy guacamole, that was ridiculous! Is there a save button up here? Oh, give me a save button, please! I don't want to die. Because I'm not sure I can do that again. Oh man, I gotta wipe, walk across this tightrope? Oh my god, no! Don't, don't let me fall, please! I need to save. I need to save. <gasps> guys, I'm almost there. Yes! <laughs> I hit the save button. And guys, it's my old friend, a Trixie Bridges. Well, it's not really my friend at all. And I'm dying. I'm dying. I'm dying. <laughs> oh, man. All right. Maybe green is for good. Nope. Nope. And nope. I fell into lava. Okay, maybe yellow. Ooh, it was yellow. Okay. Um. Green? No! Oh! All right, guys. Well, I got the first one down. Look, someone's name is Hot Chocolate. Ooh, that's making me so hungry for a treat right now. All right. Um, yellow. Maybe yellow again. No! Oh, this is so hard. So hard! I'm never going to get away from Nanny K. Look at her ugly face! All right. I'm picking yellow and then blue. Oh, my God. It was red. <laughs> it was the exact color I did not choose. Oh, okay. All right, here we go. Yellow. Maybe it changes every time. Wouldn't that be gray, gray? Red. Maybe green. No, it's not green. I'm guessing blue. I don't know why. I just feel like it's blue. So wait, what was the first two colors again? Oh my gosh, I forgot. Never mind, I didn't forget. Yellow. And then red. I'm, I'm kind of gray, gray today, guys. Don't mind me. Then maybe blue. Yes, guys! Oh, I finally made it to a checkpoint. What's this? Oh, lava squares. Don't jump on the lava squares. Look at my head. Oh, that's so sad. Look at Nanny K. She's ugly. Sorry, Nanny K, but you are. You're ugly on the inside because you're, you you made me be trapped in this obby. Um, okay. I'm doing good so far, even though I have this crazy tail following me. Yes, I made it to a checkpoint. Guys, this obby is not anything like I expected. I thought it, I would be in like Nanny K's house, but she set up this crazy obstacle course for me and a bunch of other subscribers and they have all either died or left me in the dust. <laughs> yes! Oh, 
Oh, a Trixie wall. Hmm, I'm gonna go with the same color. No! All right, um, I can do this, right guys? I can do this? All right. Uh, green? Bam, 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 bam. Fail! Oh my goodness, okay, um, red maybe? Oh my gosh, could I get any of these right? I, I really don't know. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I'm getting them right now because uh, it was the last thing I chose. Blue? Is this a save? Um, okay. Red? No! <laughs> I'm dreaming about cookies right now because cookies are nicer, friendlier. Yeah, cookies are friendlier than this obby. What about blue again? Come on! I have to get some right eventually, right? I don't know, guys. Even though obbies can be kind of like, ah, frustrating, I love obbies. Now I can't remember the colors I actually chose. I don't think I chose green. Um, yeah, I must have. Oh my gosh, I'm getting confused, guys. I know, wait, is it blue both times? Whoa, almost fell off the edge. Yeah, we bad. Blue, and then blue. Okay, which one did I choose? I, I'm so confused right now. I think I chose red. Okay, and I know I chose yellow, right? Wait, don't touch the blue. Whoa. Okay, it's not red. It's got to be yellow. I can't believe I, I got confused right there. I was too busy yapping and yapping and yapping. Talking to you guys. I didn't even know where I was going. Okay. I got this. Finally. Wait, there's another one? Oh, MG. Okay, red. No! Ah! <laughs> I'm never getting out of here. Not ever. Um, all right, so blue, yellow, green, maybe? Nope. Nope, 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 and nope! Maybe blue. Blue again? Whoa, I had the hiccups right there. <gasps> oh my gosh, I had him again. Holy guacamole. Maybe it's blue again. Oh, it is, and there's still more. How about red? No, oh my god, guys. I can't remember all these colors! My brain is literally starting to melt. I'll get you, Nanny K, for this. I'll get you! Too old for a nanny anyway. All right, wait. It was blue, yellow, blue, yellow? No, okay. <laughs> oh, man, I saw the hiccups, too. Blue and yellow. And blue and green? Guys, I feel like such a noob right now. I'm such a noob. Blue, yellow, blue, red? Okay, wait a minute. I, if they're changing, they have to be. Oh. Is there a skip the stage? I want to do a skip the stage so bad right now. Blue. Yellow. Blue. Blue? Oh, man, guys! Wait, did I go the wrong way? That would be so tragic. What's this? A maze? Oh, my gosh. They really do want my brain to melt. They want my brain to explode, guys. <laughs> I'm gonna find a way out of this maze. Um, all right, which way should I go, guys? This way? Ah, oh, it's like a big circle. Okay. We I just went through the wall. Did you guys see that? It was crazy. Ah, uh, you know what, guys? Can I just do like an overhead? <laughs> I'm cheating. Well, sort of. I can't really get, like, too far ahead. But this may work, guys. It may. Uh, nope. Dead end. Let me out of your stinking maze! Uh, no. Okay, that one just went in a big circle. This is like a trick, guys. If you're ever playing Roblox, you can't find your way out of a maze. You can do the overhead. Sometimes you can see a little bit more of what's going on. But I don't, I don't know. Did I just go this way? I'm not... Okay, wait. No, guys, I made it out. Hooray! 
hey, look at this. Some um, money, which is my favorite. Well, besides cupcakes and cookies and stuff like that. And summer vacation. <laughs> please, Nanny K, please. I'm going to tell my mom and you're never going to get to babysit me ever again. Wow, my dear. That is if you can ever escape. I will escape. I will. It's the last thing I do, Nanny K. Oh, well, it looks like it's going to be the very last thing you do. <laughs> Man, she doesn't even have any teeth. She gross. You're gross, Nanny K. Because you're so mean. OMG. All right. Um. Yep, I can go here and here. What, 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 what? Ah! 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 Oh my god, guys. I almost fell in that down that little tiny hole there, and I would have died. Alright, now it's a little bit of a lava maze. Don't touch the side. I'm like melting my pool floaty right now. But the green is okay to touch. Slime is okay, I guess, in this game. Um, guys, I can't believe I played this game right now. <laughs> uh, I thought it was gonna be much different, but. Thanks for sticking it out with me, guys. I know you guys... Ah, I touched the wall. I touched the wall, and it's a lava wall. I know you guys are my biggest fans, so it means the world to me that you guys watch my videos. I feel like the luckiest girl in the entire world that I have such amazing fans, guys. This is a shout-out to all of you. You guys are amazing. Wait, what? I just walked off the edge? Are you serious? Uh, yeah, this game is ridiculous. But I know I'm gonna make it. I'm, I'm gonna make it, guys. Alright, here we go. Whoa! I haven't played an obby like this in a long time. Usually the obbies now on Roblox are more like stories, you know? I kind of like those, though. So they just feel like they're really fun to play. Oh my gosh. This, this kind requires a lot of skill. You can't be a noob. If you're a noob, it's gonna take you forever. Woo! What is this? Oh, are those spikes? Um, okay, let's not touch those. That would probably hurt just a little bit to touch that. Whoa! All right, yes! Ooh, there's the pool! Oh, wait, um, can you stand in the center of these? Or are you gonna die? All right, it's an invisible pool. Oh, man! Bam, bam, bam. Died again. I've died like 6,000 times in this game. You've got me, Nanny K. You've got me. Oh, my dear. <laughs> I love when you die a lot. What? You love when I die a lot? That's rude. That's not a very nice thing to say. Well, I'm evil. What do you expect from me? Um, well, you should try not to be so evil. And this obby just never ends. It's the obby that never ends. Yes, it goes on and on, my friends. Like, seriously, it goes on forever. Like, this lady's, old lady's life. She's living forever. She's like a cat. She has nine lives. And each life, she gets more and more evil. This is not lava. Yeah, okay. I'm not going to believe that. Why? You think I trick you? Uh, yes. Nanny K, I do. I think you're evil. Evil and also uh, lots of evil. This obstacle course she's built is just insane, guys. And I fell in hot lava again. All right, guys. Uh, this time I'm going to try not to die. Here we go. Here we go. So far, so good. All right, how do we get down from here so I don't die? Let me look down. Oh, I'm looking down was a bad idea. Blech. Now I'm gonna throw up. Oh my gosh, all right, I made it. Checkpoint! Oh, these lava squares are the worst. They are the worst when you're on these tight ropes and you have a giant, you know, mermaid pool floaty on your butt. <laughs> oh, seriously, that guy just pushed me into one. Oh my goodness, what? Say what? Say what? All right. Let's do this. What? 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 Who's doing amazing? Not me. <laughs> Not me. I was gonna brag that I was doing so good that time, but uh, no. 
No, no, no. That part is really hard. It's like, oh my gosh. All right, let me try again. This, I feel like, I feel like this nanny has really got it out for me. Of course I do, dear. I want you to be trapped in my obby forever. <laughs> oh, um, gee, this psycho lady. All right. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, come on! Oh, there goes my head. I lost my head over it. <laughs> um, wait, I'm confused. Where am I? Okay, there we are. For a minute there, I was like, oh god, I don't even know where I am. Wait, is this the end? Guys, I think this might be the end. If I can get through this last part, I'll have escaped her. Oh, but you don't seem to be able to escape very good. Be quiet, evil! Monster granny, nanny, nanny, great. You're a nanny too, but you're a granny. You're a granny and you're a nanny. Oh my gosh. I'm glad you're not my grandma. My grandma's like the sweetest. Oh, she'd never put these lava bricks on this tight walk and tightrope and try to get me to walk across it. You know what I'm trying to say, right, people? <laughs> Whoa. Oh. Ah! I need to skip a stage so bad. I'm not kidding, guys. After this, I am so going to McDonald's. I am. You just wait and see. If you make it to the end of the video, guys, you watch all the way to the end of the video, there's going to be a surprise. You just wait. I'm going to give you a surprise at the end of the video. Surprise! Um, is I, I have to survive first, and then I'll give you the surprise. All right. Um... Guys, if you think I can make it past this, slam the like button, guys. I just need you to believe in me. Please, believe in me. <laughs> I'm being so weird right now. Sorry. Um, I guess I should just concentrate and stop singing and stuff. All right, here we go, guys. A moment of silence for me trying to make it through this very difficult part of the Abbey. Here we go. Crazy Trixie Bridges. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna see if I can step out on a little. Oh, no, 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 no. Sometimes you can cheat them and be like, all right, I'll just step out on the edge here. And then you can see if you're gonna go through it. And if you do, then you don't have to step on that one. But it didn't work. But I'm wondering if I could just jump. Oh, no! It oh, man. I thought maybe it was just like um, close enough that I could jump it and not do the bridge. But nope. Oh, he's waiting for me. He's like, are you going to show me which one to use? Come on, Lucas. Oh, he did. Thank you. So green. Come on, Molly. I'll help you across. Oh, my gosh. That is so super nice of you. <gasps> he did. Oh, my gosh. No, you can't escape. Get back here, you little brat. See you later, cray cray lady. Um, okay, I can't. Ugh, there we go. Guys, look at this. There's a hot tub. I finally can chill in the hot tub with my pool floaty. <sighs> now I promised you guys a surprise, so let's get it. All right, guys. I said I was going to McDonald's, and I wasn't lying. Oh, yeah. Look at all this delicious stuff in here. Um, Nobody's working either, so I'm just going like, to go back here, and I'm going to like make myself so many delicious things. Like, seriously, I'm going to have... Um, uh, a Big Mac, a Happy Meal, French fries. I'm starving. Mmm, this is delicious. Guys, thanks so much for watching today. I hope you have an amazing day. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!